Bang here, where the niggas get geek. Had some niggas selling them dimes on the front street, right there in front of Shotted Low Shot. Right there where the nigga rolled up and got popped. They ain't seen nothing. Right there by the checkers. Pick and pay. Right there by my auntie. Make the left at the motherfucking Chef Run, post it up. Shit, that's where you might find me. Damn. You coming back up, but you going down Jackson Park, we don't lack up. You better hit and get home with the back up. You better go back down there with the back up. Hit how the ridge, how the wood cold. We go to flip a temper and stop by the stove. That's the do drop in and you do drop in to get the 125, 25 or the 125. You no, know, the west side, <laughs> where I ride. Take the motherfucker down to South Cobb Drive. Now we in Cobb County. Police behind me. What a nigga gonna do? They can't find me. Hit the smash out. Hit the 285 to the south side. Jumped off on Camelton Road. And then I caught that bitch straight to Camp Creek. And then bust a left. Then I came down south a little more. Hey. Better hit old nasty. Fly by knockout. Knockout something when you're coming down bumping. Oh, remember where the old Dennis used to be at? Yeah. <laughs> nigga hit the hotel smell. Trying to find him a little tail. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about, nigga. <laughs> Say a lot of niggas hey. pulling them triggers. You going about Pascal's I don't know nothing Ooh. about none Trying of that shit. Trying to catch you a big nut. I'm trippin' in the hotel lobby and I got Ooh. a motherfuckin' pussy lip on my eyelid. That wasn't happen. <laughs> I ain't capping. Nigga in this motherfucker and we straight rapping on the dome. We got Fable in this bitch and I know he going crazy cause he just left his home and you know it's going down off the head. Nigga Fabo might grab on his leg. You know it's going down in this bitch one time. Yeah, it's going do it off the motherfucking rhyme. Can't yeah, get him mic'd up. The beat. Get him mic'd up. Tip to a nigga, you know we don't give a fuck. Got sad over there, right he ain't really doing shit, but we fuck right with up. the nigga, so you ain't gotta miss. Hey, oh. Let's put him in the middle. Okay, let's do it. Appreciate that. Here you go. My nigga, my nigga. My nigga. We gonna put you right here. <laughs> Ooh! That's some good titty music right there on the Tuesday. We're gonna put you in there right here. Now. This your water, Chico? Yeah. 85 side, nigga. 85 side, running. 85 now. We on that 85 side, 85 side, got an 85 mouth. On oh, 85 crazy. couch, we yeah. an 85 mouth, and you know I spent the night at a big bitch house. Ooh, I ain't never going out. She can put a nigga out because I live here, because I paid the rent. She must have had a big, now. big mouth, because oh, you yeah. tell her she already told. She <laughs> told her she already showed. <laughs> they done already know. Oh. <laughs> She gon' already explode. go. Oh, you know how it go, you know how it go. It's the 85 South and Fable. Oh. That nigga geeked up, he came at the door, got a couple Percocets in the pocket. Oh no. Oh no! Oh, no. Yeah, oh, you heard no. what he said. <laughs> I said you heard what he said. Percocets in his pocket, got the nigga seeing spaceships on Bankhead. Oh, bank Can't help it. And I'm you starting to see spaceships on Bankhead. That's the hook right there. I'm starting to see spaceships on 85 South. 85 South. Ooh. I'm starting to see spaceships on 85, 85 South. 85, 85 South. South. I'm starting to see spaceships Now let on. me tell you what it was. <laughs> I was chilling in the city. A alien bitch done pulled up in the spaceship Ooh. and pulled out about eight cities. Ooh. Let that sink in. Ooh, she Just was think an about alien. that. <laughs> what you I'm think about? Yeah. <laughs> but I ain't trying to cape a friend. Ooh. Hey. I might call a cape a friend. Ooh. Okay. Turn into a fucking ape, my friend. Go off in that motherfucker like Ben. A big foe. Ooh. Watch the hit bag at the dough. Ooh. Get a big bag at the dough. Ooh. Walk up out that bitch with a faux foe. Tell her carry that shit. Cause they catch me, bitch. You going down, ho. You going down. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 kitty. I'ma suck on it. That's that work. What? By the time I got to the fourth one, I had to stop because my jaw started hurting. Ooh, I said stop. I can't do it. Hold up, wait, wait. We ain't gonna, we ain't gonna go that way. <laughs> <laughs> Freestyle just stopped. Perfect G. I, was, I said the titty though. <laughs> Fabo! Mm. God damn, Fabo, I said the titty. I nigga. stayed down the street in Atlanta. <laughs> when you leave Peace Street and you go about three streets down, I'm where you don't want to be. You see snow in the blood. I did. I grew up down in that area. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, Way to switch it up. And no I, nigga jaw hurting down there. All right. <laughs> well, I, we had the alien bitch titties. You, 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 you was by yourself. I was by myself. I know that's why my shit didn't fuck you, it. You, you was in that little part that come off the Star Trek and hey. then go out and start, you know, the, when he the, come. The ramp? When he come off the Enterprise and go down by himself. Uh-huh. You down there then. Oh, okay. All right. Appreciate you. Well, fuck it then. Yeah, yeah. We, we threw that one. Yeah. He killed it. Killed it. Damn it, I don't Chico. know how to go behind that. <laughs> Jay Wynn, give us another yeah, one. You ain't from that side of town, though, is it? They gonna say Chico killed it. I know that. I know give that. us another one. We'll come back to that one. There you go. Shit, I told y'all my nigga would come.
What's happening? What's up, gang violence? What's, what's up, what's up, my nigga? <laughs> yeah, it does. Oh, what's up, my nigga? <laughs> nigga, look at my shit. We be getting started. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm you good. Cool. I'm catching the vibe before we start. It's all good. It's all you all had right, one man. not too long ago. I thought about you when I looked at this shit. I'm like, that nigga ain't got damn sent that bitch in the mail. <laughs> What you got on? What? You fuck with him? When he came over, you got these two years ago? Yeah, uh huh. No, I said I got, I was asking Chico. Mm -hmm. These one of the ones that came I got all y'all fucked up. And got slept on. Yeah, I got all y'all fucked up. My what? shoe got two scraps on them. Uh, double scraps. These bitches came in the case. <laughs> he came with my belt. You want switch sides, fly? All right. Oh, no, nah, nigga. You got another special nigga in the house tonight. Uh -uh. Don't get that nigga his special mic. None of that. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. We know you good already. You got to get a messed up mic. It's like, it like when you come on my house, I'm so good at Mortal Kombat, I give you the messed up joystick. You know it. You know Just so I know how good I am. <laughs> West side nigga in the building. West side taking over, man. <laughs> The nigga be in another mode when we bring the West Side up here. You know, I know it. Wow. Bruh, get wet. I told them folks you had your car parked up there all that time. Soon you got some money, they thought you walked out there and put the money in the car. Bruh, what type of nigga that is? Man, I said, bro, I said, been up there for, so, for so long. long. Now, now this nigga, the soon the nigga out there and say, I signed with these folks. He come on out the next day. I said, boy, I already know what they did. Said he done went out there and put the money in the trunk. The money in the car. Boy, I, I almost started crying. I almost started crying. This nigga broke all the windows. I seen it. You got rid of that truck. Hey. You got rid of the truck, then. <laughs> he let them bitches he set up. Like, he let them got. bitches set up there so they can see what they did to it and talk shit to it. I was so mad because I jumped off the side. Regular official tide, stop tide. That man was mad at hell, boy. Told, I, nigga tried to take my tide, nigga. I'm riding. I'm riding. Nigga was riding it too. He hugging the horn. I'm like, ah, put my strap on my lap. I'm like, roll the window down. I'm like, what's up, bro? He like, hey, nigga, I'm letting you know you're back tired. Wobbling in the bitch. I'm like, I knew I felt something. Nigga, I get out of the car, nigga. Oh, my, 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 my little nigga's gone. Wow. They gone. Nigga tried to get me while I was handling my mini. I was about to say, oh, nigga. Tide. Nigga tried to get you shit while you was riding, nigga. Nigga, oh, the way I got my truck <laughs> set up, the, the nuggets, you need a lock. You need a that certain lock to get it off. Right. So when them niggas figure that shit out, they try to come back. They, they, you know what that, they that, twist uh, it off and try to come back. That lock on them lug nuts do. Yeah. They don't do nothing but make the niggas who, who steal rims mad as hell. They can't get I bought my guy, I bought the rim lock, the other one, you know, the security. Yeah. Man, security. that motherfucker took all them bitches and stole my rims and threw all of them in the yard. Man. Just to let you know, bitch, them bitches don't work. You can keep them back. Put them in the yard. They let you know, bitch, it don't work. Next time, fuck that. Yeah, if you want them, we get them. That's Damn. crazy, man. Look, I, got, all I, in I got out and ran in the mall, parked in the front, and parked in the mall. And I was in there, I went in there to get something fixed on the ring, came back out, it was gone. The whole Dang. car. The whole, the whole car. Vert, my vert. They got no, my I, no, vert. I they got my 74, took the rims and stuff. I just started back working on it. They took the rims off of it. Took all the music out of it, took the whole dashboard, brick. all of everything. Hey man, put them on brick. Yeah. Yo, you a damn, this Atlanta shit. You niggas, them niggas down here breaking the cars yeah. like New Jersey Drive, nigga. Y'all got this, yeah. boy. Yeah, because hey, niggas I, steal I, everything. What? Cause we stupid as fuck. Cause I we, used to steal everything. When we get out, car, we want to go park it right up at the park. Going I right in. Park, and keep, right try to keep it running I'm like going nigga. From Matt out nigga, to fuck English. with you, but nigga is going to take your shit. Nigga, I fought with him, but I got to have that. But you looking at one of them niggas that'll ride around the park 13 times playing Scotty. Boom, boom, just so you can hear my music. Boom, boom, boom. Crazy. Keep coming by y'all like this. <laughs> Why you think I smile so much? I learned that at the park. <laughs> For real? On Sunday. Oh, I thought y'all had to be nah, uh, I used to have dollar shots in the car. <laughs> <laughs> dollar shots? What the fuck is that? Oh, that was the nigga. What? Nigga. What? I, what? You know, I'm, hey, I'm, Crack I'm, water, I'm, nigga. I'm, 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 I just said, when you I'm made the last statement, nigga, I knew you went from where I, I was from. Yeah, from. Yeah, 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 I'm not from, I'm from Okay, when the dollar shot on, on Sunday, yeah, looks, looks so be closed on Sunday. Everybody go to the park, run into the nigga with the dollar shot. That means you spent one dollar, he got a little cup, he posts something in there, you try to get him to pull a little bit more for you. You understand me? Uh-huh. Yeah, sir. Ski. Damn. You damn near tap it a little bit just to get a little drop. He also said what? 
Cigarillo, Black and Mild, uh, Swiss Sweet, Peppermint, Jolly Ranch. It's really the man on wheels. I used to be the weed man, man on wheels. That's crazy. I used to be the weed man that had a weed and a Swiss. And get what happened. Get what happened. Niggas start sitting there smoking one with you every time. No, I went with that what? shit. What? Why? Because I ain't got niggas. Pray for Jesus. You telling me I got to smoke with every customer that buy with me? Yeah. I'm going to be high Okay, tell this out. It's hell. For everybody who come to you, <laughs> hold up. But everybody who come to you show, you get that dollar back. You see what I'm saying? They don't get the blunt. But see, I had $4 every time say, you eat, I Every time you eat or use a restroom, you don't smoke a blunt. What you say? Every time you eat or use a restroom, you don't smoke a blunt. I do. Okay, well, that what you get, you don't have to smoke that See, blunt. I didn't want to smoke with them niggas. See, yeah. then I started going into my stash. Because, you know, once the chop get blown. Oh, so you saying when he smoke one, you got to smoke one with him. No, so I can't do that. Oh, no. So you the weed I'm man. trying to save he your right. weed. You okay. actually obligated you don't take to no smoke shots? one with him. I do take some. I had four dollars. Then when you get him all <laughs> back in, when he smoked with you, Nigga, you get all of those man. shots. But see, back. I didn't want to smoke with him. You already get four dollars sack. Oh, but just him, I just everybody. If you get a four dollars sack. I really How don't like it. How come the nigga who always come with $4 just got all that game? I'm talking about good $4. They Christmas, And too. then pull it out like they right with it. He want to hey. look over every sack. Hey, let me see. I already see. know he shot. Let me see. Cause he go looking over every sack tomorrow. Oh, this bit right here fat. Right now. Yeah. <laughs> this bit right here fat. This, <laughs> this it right here. But you know what? If you had $5, you get let a battle. Stupid ass boy. What the fuck wrong with you? Nigga, so why what? do you want to settle for $4 sack? Listen, that's my question. The beat on your door so hard. Six o'clock in the morning. You got eight dollars. Hey, no Mac, no Mac, boy, I gotta go to work. I got eight dollars. Boy, I'm like, boy, you hit my goddamn door, boy, you waking my goddamn baby up, boy. Eight dollars. Where you gonna? Boy, I ain't got the goddamn four dollars, boy. Come on, get in for me real quick before I go to work. Come on, bro, I don't fuck with you like this all the time, man. You know I'm the one to come everything. I'm like, bro, they gone. They come on. Gone get. They gone. They always gotta tell you how they, much they spent with they you. No land, we how much they spent. Then he pull out a whole bag of change. He gotta count it all right now. God, hold <laughs> up. This my and question. Nickel. DC. In nickel. Hey, how you keep your four dollar sacks away from your five dollar sacks? You put them in different colors. Nah, <laughs> oh my god. Bruh. Bruh. Ooh. Red sack, Ooh. they look, they real look. Look, they do. You see the 10 10? The 10 10, they like that. They like that, right? You get the 11. You get the 125 10s or 125 or 125. Or 125 10. That was for like $15. No. Yes, all. You gonna do the big 10 10 like that? See this. Oh. See, I ain't did it in a minute. Yeah, see, you one twenty five ten gonna be you the big little ten ten, little small. You small. And, then, and then you got the, then you got the, then you got the little eight more. You got, a you got the double zero. That's what you saying. You gonna give them four dollars? They gonna nigga, be some double zero. It was so hard to goddamn open them bitches up. That's what yeah, I learned about the ass. Yeah, they end up being the double zero, like pink the little small nigga. Why I be mad? Why you come to the nigga about three o'clock in the morning? He go, hey, I'm trying to serve you little little bitty bitches out the window, boy. But I come through that, boy. You gonna give me three of these? That went three for the ten came from. Three for the ten. They had a little bit of that motherfucker by trying to give them a little bit of that bass of weed, but now. What the fuck was you using to put them in the bag? You ain't got nothing but a cardboard and a bunch of tweezers. Tweezers, bro, You were grabbing them in and put them in that motherfucker. This stuff in weed bags with tweezers, my nigga. Hey, nigga's. Chico, it, it's a, uh, some, hey. some petty hustlers. Bro, right, I, wish right. a nigga, I wish a nigga would try yeah. me with a little bit of sack. You ain't got nothing but a goddamn air conditioner right here and a little piece of cardboard. I so reach look, in and slap shit out you, boy. This is how long the shit me. been going on. You're in the trap, bro. <laughs> you remember on Outkast song, Dirty South? Uh-huh. You don't remember what Cool Breeze said? See, never Why did I, I think. Cool Breeze on me right now? Call I got Daniel room. That's some peewee sacks to beat and took this time. Say. That's hey. what he was talking about, them motherfuckers. Mm -hmm. Little small bags. Let me tell you When I realized a nigga was coming short and I was stuffing the bag too fat, I said, no, sir. I got to have something for the short coming. You need, you need a cigar? You need to smoke bad, don't you? Stop the whole show. Stop the whole show. Excuse the whole show. me. Okay, hey, let me get one of them damn blunts over there. It's like you go. Yeah, yeah. 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 Make sure she Matter get one. Right. Go, I'm telling you. You got a couple of them coming. You need yeah, to go. I ain't lying. God damn. She said, excuse me, my brothers. I'm, I'm sorry. You, you guys continue to have your little reunion, but let me get one of those up off. Hey, you know what? Be the, this be the perfect something. time for this right here. Hey, welcome back to the 85 South Show. We are in here. DC. I, was saying, I got another kind too. Yeah, I was doing numbers outside. Like, listen, these niggas are having a West Side reunion. They having a whole West Side reunion. Y'all don't understand. West Side. Man, 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 man see each other everywhere, but we be so busy, we just be passing each other. All right, people shout it. We be shouting when I shout it. Legend. Well, look, man, that's what exactly what I was getting man, to. We, see each we got a real, year, a real we West Side so legend, legend. West in this, this motherfucker. motherfucker. You know him. Yeah. Oh, Mr. Geek Music. Yeah. Mr. Pray for Jesus. Yeah. Mr. Tatted Up. 
Mr. Bass, you can't do it Hello. like me. Oh, Mr. Spacious Spacious on don't Grab your that motherfucking leg, nigga, nigga put it on your Scotty. shoulder. You hear me? I'm starting to see spaceships on bank. Bank. Let me tell you something. We I was starting to look for them bitches. I don't like to see one of them motherfuckers. We was starting to look for them bitches. We was like, man, what the hell is It was so believable. He's like, he on bank My nigga, when I first came, my first time ever coming to Atlanta, I came down here, my uncle do hair. And we was coming out. Wait, 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 wait. I don't even think you need to tell no more man, stories. Man, that's fucked up. Bro, that like the man, second boy, story you done told, G, though, nigga. bro. That was just like, like a gangster, nigga. It be something in your he, story, bro. To, he, we learned how to do hair when he went that, to jail. That, that, what I'm trying to tell you is, like, listen. What? All right, my mom dropped me off over my daddy's house 14 years old. I was over in John Bus out. My daddy came out. That nigga said, look, nigga, I don't want you in my house before I get out work. Nigga, I, need, I know your mama told me what you was doing. I don't need around my woman. Look at that nigga like, I'm brown 14. What the fuck that's what I do till you get out of work? Boy, he like, don't want you my I get out of school at 2, boy. He get home about 6, 7 o'clock. So I'm going to start sitting on the steps and shit like that. He's like, I'm just giving you a story that you tell around, nigga. Don't, don't tell you, man. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck out of here, Fabo. Like I said, nigga, my uncle do hair, nigga. One of the coldest niggas do hair. We came down here for the Bronner Brothers convention anyway. and shit. And as soon as we got in Atlanta, nigga, we heard motherfucking Laffy Taffy. And this is the first time I ever heard anything sound like this. I'm a DC nigga. We ain't never heard no shit like this before. So my first question to you is, nigga, these niggas is having a reunion. I don't know what you heard about. <laughs> I heard your song. Pray I for know you. Pray for that nigga. Jesus said, we on three pills. We negotiation no need another three mil. <laughs> Did you better tell Jesus? It was clear in the song. It was me and Faye Beasy. You okay. know, we were hanging out a little bit before the, the rap game. So oh, for real? He kind of was just telling on me a little bit right now. <laughs> I was just trying to figure it out. I ain't never said that. I ain't never said I that. Did. Story, nigga, I ain't ain't never said I, you want to hear my story? Okay, I was standing outside a club in Miami. I had on some baseball socks. That's why I went right there today. The they wouldn't let me in the club. It was me and three bitches. All of them was standing out there. And they were talking about, oh, Fabo. Well, then, you know, they were going through that shit. But they were photo rap. And we had some baseball socks. And they said he wasn't going to let me in without my shoes on. And so Jesus. Time out, nigga. See, time out. Don't yeah, skip over that, nigga. I just told him I had on. outside with baseball socks. I'm known for shoes. my baseball socks right now, 20 years later. I mean, that you worked out for me. You, you got on baseball socks right now. I, I, that worked out for me, bruh. What is you talking about? Nigga, I still wear long socks. Right I got today. you, but with the shoes, you ain't had no shoes on, nigga. You got that looking like a ninja. was geeked up, bruh. That's just where we was on. So you were moonwalking to the goddamn club. Oh, look. I was thinking about Charles Manson without all the killing. Me and the girl that were with us, we was in there on some, uh, and we just didn't look like we needed to be in the club. <laughs> so Jesus didn't walk by with these suitcases and shit. I'm looking at them niggas, they look like they like came from the office building to the club or right. something, you know, but they were making a move or something, I don't know. I seen them movies and shit. When they got a briefcase, he going in the club, shit about to happen, you feel what I'm saying? I wanted to get on in there for real then. Right. But, but I, I, I just wanted to get on in the club, because you know, they everybody know who I was back then. I went rapping then though, so I keep saying that for a reason. I heard right. you I know, I got you, sing, you were singing Shout there. Nah, I, I, I ain't never sang but nowhere in jail. See, you oh. had to know me from jail to know I was a singer. Oh, oh you we'll had to be about Bro, look, look, wait, wait, oh, but bro, bro, you used to sing in jail, Hold up, nigga, you was in the hole, nigga, you need me, nigga. <laughs> hey, you talking about, bro? <laughs> Two wrong don't make a right. Hey. Tonight is the night. Yo. But I've been at this. It's all I can do. Yeah. You've been in the hole like this, drawing pictures on envelopes, nigga, with the little heart and everything for your girl. Ten lies and shit. Hey, you talking about? Look, you made me forget what the hell I was you about to tell you. You was about to walk in the club for those shoes. Briefcase. Nah, I would pad that. We had them shoes. You was about to walk in the club. No, I was gonna say, rewind the camera. He had no shoes. You ain't rapping. Nah, that was not rapping. You had them left that alone. You had the briefcase. I was finna tell you something else, though. But they know you from rapping Jesus at that point. Jesus had the but I, had the he, he had to miss me up. I was finna go somewhere Jesus totally had different. The yeah, you ain't but I, no shoes. I wasn't gonna tell the rest of that story because that was it. You don't kind of tell it That's all. That's it? Yeah, that so was it. So you just saw Jesus and you still ain't put no shoes That was on. just the night that I met Jesus. Oh, so yeah. evidently we had a great time because we ended Hold up. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. I had to get in the you club. went from not having the no nigga, shoes on. The next time I heard from the nigga, he was just saying, Fabo, I got you. You don't have to give me nothing for this. So evidently he had a good time. You feel me? At the club that I was at, well, I had a good time. I had three bitches with me. He had 75 people with him. But you ain't had no shoes on. I must have made an impact with the couple of people I was with. Right. Yeah. I'm, I'm good at what I do. Pray for Jesus. Fuck you, man. Ooh. Bruh. <clears throat> I, I, listen to, I listen to your lyrics, man. Yeah. And it's like, 
You say that shit with so much passion. It makes me feel like ah, I know, I know I who know. the fuck you talking about. So I gotta Stand ask, it up. how is chocolate Porsche and, and Yasmin? How are they, are they all nah, chocolate good? and Porsche. Those were my homegirl. Chocolate, R.I.P. Chocolate. I was actually shot a little baby mom. Mm-hmm. It was with my homegirl and uh, Porsche was the girl down the sidewalk. They wouldn't get up, and I went to the studio and just had to make that song that night, and I was still mad at them. Oh. Dangerous. They, they dangerous. My, my sister Yasmin, you know, she, that's just my sister. Yasmin, my sister. She, yeah. I felt like they was dangerous she shot when you said too. that. She, she, she shot the fuck, too. Yeah. Yeah. You ever seen my show on Instagram where I be telling people, get the fuck out of my yeah, life? Yeah, I seen the nigga yeah. jump she up and grab both feet. She didn't want to give y'all the questions and shit. She be on that bitch telling me, show me the up, down, braid. I ain't never seen that shit in my life. But every nigga with some, a perm in his head or something like that, I come on there and got some dreads. Yeah. I ask him the question, everybody go crazy. I yeah. did see when you made the nigga jump up and grab both lips. Boy, you got the L.A. motherfucking now, you, man. Nigga. How the fuck? What's my motherfucking name? Oops. That Let's nigga look half cleaner and half predator. I'm not Snoop Dogg. I'm Oops Dogg. I'm not even going to flex, my nigga. You, you fucking these her. niggas. You, you fucking these fuck. niggas up. Man, let me you you nigga. fucking hey, these hey, niggas. Hey, I don't know that nigga. I thought I was. I, bro, I wear a bald head since I was in high school. I thought I was bald. I thought, I, everybody who know me. What's wrong with you, I just woke up one day and, you know, I used to wear this shit before Cisco and all them niggas. See, I you ain't know that these, did you? No, man. Yeah, see, I was on a song with Drum and Pastor Troy, <coughs> what, 98, 99, something like that. It's on see? the map. See, it's on the map. See what I'm saying? Look at the buddy know ATL history. So I've been around way before these niggas. You see what I'm saying? But yeah, I, I, I went blonde hair way back then. But see, Cisco came out and just fucked it all up. I'm standing in front of the store selling dope. That nigga was, yeah, I, I got cut this took shit. took over. You were singing the jam. Nah, nigga. I cut that, I cut that shit the next day. Mm. <laughs> it was a rap. A nigga called me Cisco one time. I got to fight and it was over with. It was over All right. with. Like that shit. Standing this in front of Hollywood Plaza in front of Jurassic Park, but it just didn't get right. Went, oh, they drag and whatever that nigga was saying, it went right. Mm-mm. Who is Rapper. Barbara? Barbara Bush. That's who you were singing to at the Oprah end of the Oprah Barbara Bush. Martha Stewart, Hillary Clinton. Barbara Bush, they all so got, rich, they rich got some secret women. tattoos. And no, that just felt like they had secret tattoos. Like, I was just saying, you know, so Why Barbara, though? Because, nigga, Cause when I you... I was just saying, Barbara... Bar- <laughs> you hit that bitch and everybody was like, I don't know Barbara, but that's my part. <laughs> but, I, I, but, hey, believe it or not, though, dude, I was on, like, 10 when I came in. I believe that. Like, that's, that's what, what I'm saying. Like, like, somebody called me from somewhere else, yeah. and they were like, uh, yo, they got the young dudes in the studio. I had already heard a song with uh, my homeboy, City. That's my partner. And uh, I had heard the song with him, you right. know. And Sid was always telling me that something about the blow, something about the blow, but they called me that night. Then, you know, I'm, I'm just chasing the bag. You feel me at that time? But you up two, three o'clock in the morning, you hit studio, 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 25, 35, 45, you know, that I would count it. But uh, you know, I just so happened to hang out with him at a little convention thing or whatever. And we pushed the issue. I pushed, started pushing for him and stuff like that, start performing the song. And you know, they took the uh, part that I had in the beginning and put it at the end. I actually did that as soon as I walked in the studio. He was like, I need you to get on this song. I walked in there and did that and then wrote the verse. Dang. So you wouldn't say, Bobby! That shit was all as soon as I walked in the studio. That's the first thing that yeah. came in your head. Man, like I said, this when I first heard you, genius. it was something and I never take... heard before. Cause I'm looking for Mrs. Bubbles. <laughs> okay. I'm Mrs. Jingle D. I want a daughter. Ow! Cause she's so thick. Girls call me jumping on you. Cause I stay so hard, you get something for a long time. Oh my God! Yo, this ain't the dance. Oh, get the candy store. Then I'm gonna get the baby on your job. I roll, yeah. it's off, yeah. I know yeah. it's the summertime, but yeah. you let me Hey, let me tell you something, gang. We skated to that shit not knowing you was talking about drugs. Nah, I wasn't talking about drugs on that song. What, 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 what? I'm looking for Miss Bubblegum, that's pussy. Mm-hmm. Exactly. I'm Mr. Chico Stick, that's a dick, I want to dun-dun-dun, fuck. Uh-huh, because you so thick. The whole song was just, like, girl called me Jolly Rancher, uh-huh. I stay so hard, uh-huh. like, this. I was talking about fucking the that's whole song. That's why you ain't saying nothing about no drugs. Fuck that Barbara! <laughs> no, that, that was just me. Me and you. What I'm saying is, like, you looking at the songs like you trying to define, you trying to find something in the songs. I'm just a nigga high as hell in the booth saying some shit. Having fun. Going I don't crazy. know why a nigga can relate to it like that. I, I don't know how to explain it. I, if I, you want to lie, I tell you a lie. See, what her hair Well, my granddad taught me that. No, <laughs> 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 I ain't going to tell you no lie, bro. I don't know. So you just, right. just doing it just naturally. That just will come up out of you. I don't look at what I do as dancing. I just get on stage like I don't know what I'm going to do when I get I just don't want to do what he did. Exactly. Like, I can do the 
the wall. I do all that shit. You ain't seen me in the You got to catch me. You know, I can do all. I try to practice what they doing and all of that. And I, every time I get up, I'm going to do it this time. I get on stage and then. <laughs> yeah, we're great. Somebody do that shit like, nigga, you got that. <laughs> you a you motherfucking know, some, legend, guy. Some game. other shit the I love when you say in this song, when you just randomly like, stop $2. Stop, Fabo. Who is $2? That nigga who I was trying to sing on track while I'm getting off. No, they just do it. You wait your turn. Oh, that's your alter <laughs> ego. <laughs> So he he, he want to jump that's in. That's that nigga had right niggas writing letters no, in the hole. No, 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 Everybody, my friends called me $2. You know what I mean? Y'all y'all know me as Fabo or whatever, because that's like my nickname in the hood. You feel what I'm saying? But, you know, everybody, I like to be called $2. Like, I don't, I don't you know, people who call me Fabo, I do went to school with you. Uh, you know, you know me from the rap. And I started rapping, like, fresh out of prison. I had did, like, two years in prison for 97 99. When I got out, I just turned into a rapper, like, as soon as I got out. So, you know. Everybody knew me for Fable, okay. but you know I, I had to earn that two dollar name in the street. Did you did you start rapping in jail? Is that where it came from? Yeah, I, I basically used to beat on the tr trash can like nigga be out there playing basketball. I suck at basketball, so I'm like Dennis Rodman. I just go out there and start tackling niggas. <laughs> you know. <laughs> All over the concrete. Hold on, two dollars. <laughs> Let me ask you this though. So hey man, somebody go get two dollars. That ain't tripping, man. So you talking about how you start? How you yeah. link up with Rocco? Oh, oh, I ain't never hooked up with Rocco. I, I don't think I ever met Rocco, but one probably one time in the club or something like that. Dro had, uh, I think Dro, when he left from, uh, see, me and Dro used to be a group. Yeah. And we left out of Bankhead on the same day with the same nigga, and wherever that nigga at, I'm can find you, the motherfucker. I still in town, your ass. But uh, yeah, we left out the bankhead with the same nigga. And he tried to sell us the same dream. Then Charlotte got down, we went feeling that shit. We just, we went our own path. We hooked up with uh, Raheem the Dream. And Rob was a good nigga. He just got down, really showed her how to work the game. But we went and listened to him. He was telling her to make girls on the whole time. The nigga sitting down there, I'm on the, I'm from, the police, man on my door yeah. with the GBI. My shit get on the radio. And I got play. I'm like, what you talking about, bro? They listen to this shit. Like, huh, you gonna go to the top? And I'm like, Man, no, I like this shit. It's on the map. Boom, drummer go to jail, past Truff. You know, he go his own way with the drinking there. He was just switched up the whole style. I was stuck. You know, I hit the street again. Like, boom, I'm back in the street. So, yeah, I, I, you know, Rob really showed up the game. Rob, he in the dream. That nigga was true. Appreciate Rob for that, man. For real. I'm going to keep fucking saying yeah. it. You are Me and Dro got a whole CD. We got a whole CD. We had that nigga Dro in here. That nigga Dro. I got you that. Dro yeah. came, nigga, and wiped the booger on the couch, nigga. Right. Real talk. That nigga Dro wiped the booger. Yeah, we had it straight. Yeah, we got it clean, now. though. We steamed yeah. it. Where he put it at? It was weeks ago. It was weeks ago. You might be sitting there. He said it on the couch. You might be sitting there. I ain't gonna take that. I ain't gonna fart on that motherfucker. That nigga took Where you farted at? That nigga over there. That nigga took the booger and was like, thank you, Chico. You. I'm like, God damn. They're gonna disrespect that So you ain't see where. Go. Nah, nigga, it was over there. They got see, a nigga looking for that. Look like it, right? Then it's, it's a little spot behind me, right there and shit. I don't know what that is. So that might be it, it right there. there. So, like, so, so what? Made he must have looked at that spot and then thought about yeah, it. Yeah, because you said, bro, <laughs> that shit made me remember that nigga wiped that book. Pray for Jesus. Pray for Jesus. Nah, for real though, Fabo. Like, so what made you do the infamous? You know what I'm saying? When you go up there and you do your motherfucking shit, the fucking kickback, oh. grabbing the lid, literally, <laughs> you grab that motherfucker and put it over your shoulder. Yeah, I mean, uh, I just did that shit at a show one night. Uh, we was in one of them country towns or whatever, and I just did it at a show, and I seen I could do it. I'm like, fuck it. You know what I mean? Nigga, that nigga that walk around with no socks on, he but, can do uh, anything, nigga. That I, nigga didn't ha I had it. socks on, I didn't have on no shoes. See, oh. you didn't get it. See, <laughs> well, we all had on the same pair of black and white baseball side. It was all white with the black going up the side, and we had on, like, the baseball outfit, and we walk around like this. <laughs> 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 Type zombie shit, yo. <laughs> on the west side, man. Like they about to fight Batman. That's why he went with us in the club. <laughs> hey man, one of your Fire hardest. Belt. One of your hardest verses to me yeah. is on I'm a J. Mm. I'm a J. I'm a J. I'm a J. But then you had the ad lib, but you yeah. can't say it. You can't say it. I just felt like on that Help song, me. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, nigga, man, I are just you feel okay? Like it's, a, it's a different world out here, man. Like, it's like, but are you okay though? Yeah. Girl, you was yeah. kept. You kept saying, I asked help, help me. I, I asked for help seventy five times. I I know that's why I'm asking, nigga. You all right? Nobody in that. Did nobody even help that nigga? They was just like, this shit bumping. Take from the top. Pay for the top. Pay for the top. This nigga literally in the booth. Help me. 
Nobody came in there and checked up on him. Nobody. I, I, had had to look the fly. I watched the fly times. before that. That little fly guy caught me. He turned into the fly. He was like, help me. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my you thought God. you was a fly nigga? No, nah, you ain't never seen the movie. Hey. You ain't never seen the movie. Ah! Ah! Oh, you ain't never, never seen the movie. This shit crazy. Oh! oh. White man turned into a You ain't never seen the fly. No. I don't work. I gotta go do oh, it. Oh, boy, you go. Watch, watch it with a girl. Bro, watch it with a girl. Oh, the fly. Shit, the hell out the nigga, the she ain't gonna wanna watch it. The nigga turned into a fly. Oh, he literally the turned into a fucking fly. It's a nasty shit. Ass fly. It's it's disgusting, my nigga. White people, white man turned into a fly. It's snot, all type of shit on his body, shit nasty. The nigga, I ain't really got time, man. Let me go ahead and be clear, man. Check this out. If you looking for a good place, man, that have fresh food, deliver on time, and give back to the community, nigga, hello, fresh. Offer so many recipes to choose from each week to help you break out of your recipe route. Including low, low calorie, vegetarian, and family friendly recipes every week. You know, cause I got a second baby, you dig? So I got to have somebody who gonna bring the food fresh. I'm talking about on time and it's already prepped up. So when I cut it out and put it on the stove, my, my, I mean, it take me about 15 minutes. Hey man. Anybody out there like saving money, you like discounts? Well, guess what? You can save up to 28% by using HelloFresh versus your grocery store shopping trip. HelloFresh offers fresh, high quality ingredients every week for a super flavorful experience. So what I'm trying to tell you is, make sure you go to HelloFresh.com slash 85South80. And you know what? I told you to get back. On your first meal at HelloFresh.com, you know what we're going to do? We're going to take off $80. Yes, sir. So make sure you go to HelloFresh.com slash 85South80 to get that discount. Don't worry about it. Don't trip. Because HelloFresh be cutting out all the stressful meals, planning and grocery store trips, so you can enjoy cooking and get to the dinner, all right? So go on and get your cook on. Make sure you go to HelloFresh.com slash 85South80 to get $80 off your first, your first meal. And guess what? Include it. Your free shipping. Oh, no. We, oh, we going to make sure it's free. Oh, yeah. We going to make sure it's free. But you know what? Restrictions apply. So make sure you go to HelloFresh.com and figure it out. It's, Hello, it's, it's, it's real meaning though, man. I, I like to say, you know, when you say geeked up, I, I feel like, you know, it's, it means you crunk, you gifted, you okay. lifted. But in, where I'm from, nigga may say geeked up, he hot. And so, you know, everybody where I'm from, you know, I seen my mama, you know, all these people in the street struggling or whatever. You know, I got all these uncles and everybody, you know, my mama selling blunts, straight shooter, Brillo pads, 800, Cisco, all of that every day, all day. And I felt like when I got a little older, shit, we buying bottles, filths. I'm smoking ounces. I'm at the house. I got two ounces on that. We'll smoke these ounces. We'll roll out, man. We used to roll up all the blunts and put them in a bowl. So I was like, shit, if my mama geeked up, I'm spending more money on shit than my mama is. So I'm going to be geeked up, too. You feel what I'm saying? So, you know, look, using that term, more of a term of endearment or something like that from, you know, being a product of my environment. And so I felt like it was, I, I'm hyped up still. Still mean I'm hyped up. I'm lifted. I'm gifted. But I figured air. it's that place that you can go to that can't nobody else go, but only you can pull yourself back from. Like you get into it with your mama and she make you want to do something, but you walk outside, the first nigga who you get into it with, boom, that's that geek, that you still on. Like, nigga, I knock you out. You, you still mad at your mama. <laughs> you really still mad at your mama, but. Yeah, you take it out on who you get. You see what I'm saying? You mad, right, right. I'm saying that's that place. Like you see, you get to argue with your girl, you know, the nigga in the street, you pull the two, you, you, only you can pull yourself back from that place. That's that geek, that's how I look at it. And uh, I, I say, the same thing with a nigga who at, at the store. He, he, he hustle all day for like, what, a dollar and fifty cents so he can go in there and buy a little, little pint of liquor. And he like to get geeked up quick. He gonna drink that bitch and you walk by the store, you see him right there, he farting and peeing and shit. He just wanna go there a little quicker. You feel what I'm saying? Some right. people don't have to get high at all. So, you know, it's just about you trying to deal with your reality. And so when you, you hear me help, say help me in the songs or whatever, not, not necessarily I need help, but my, I got, you see that knot on my head, I got that in the blood. Police beat me up one night, took the weed, pulled off. You see what I'm saying? I don't know what the hell it is. I go to the hospital, they like, you got a bone spur. I don't, I don't know nothing about it, but I just wrecked all them, beat me up and pulled out. So, you know what I'm saying? Help me. This is what we living in. You know? Oh, this is my hell. That was brilliant, yeah. my nigga. Damn, you made, made the shit, bro. That was brilliant. You was bullshitting at first, and then she got real. I was like, <laughs> no, you gotta bro, listen to the song. Down. You gotta listen yes. to the song. So you don't never listen to the song. All you hear is the song. I listen to all the songs. I can't see all the walls keep looking at me. Come on. I tell myself there's nothing wrong. 
can't stop gritting my teeth. I can't sleep. I can't eat. I just geek. I just geek. Can't I know I can't take one. So why not three? Shit get geek. I can't help the way I feel. Why am I so I gotta keep it real. Nigga. Yeah. But it's, it's, it's like a hood. But I'm telling you, I'm giving you one night, one experience. Like what my experience on it. But you know. I didn't want no everyday, everyday all the time thing or whatever, you feel what I'm saying? But I, I, the way I felt at that time, what was going on with me, I wanted to share. Check you this feel out, what I'm saying? But I didn't let that define me or that moment define me. Bro, we like, all right. three of us comedians. Yeah. And you a nigga that make us laugh. Yeah. And it's like. I'm a comedian too. Nigga. I just don't be trying to make, be my I know you're laugh. a comedian because no you dedicated your whole verse to all the J's one time. Yeah, facts. Big facts. Wake up, it's time. That's what I was trying to tell you Stop a minute ago. Hours. When Stop you stopped me both. and I went into the, the other conversation. <laughs> Go ahead. See? This goes now, out to I, all the You made me remember what I was saying. You what you were saying? I you had looked up there and I was like, it's a whole world of us out here. See, you ain't like that when I was telling you then. I thought about it when I was like, what I was saying. That's what I was telling you. It's a whole nother world out here. The people who they ignore. That's what I was saying. You look at her like some old crazy motherfuckers or whatever, but I look at it like, Every movie you watch or whatever, they always give you some little cup or something to drink to go over into the spiritual realm. So y'all sober niggas ain't even really, you know, really trying to see we God. We ain't tapped into the world that's available you to us. You must ain't tried to see God before. I don't want to. I'm talking about go knock on their front. I go, I try to knock on their front. You try to go knock on their go 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 door. You was up now. Who in the crib? Letitia, God stay over here. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, okay, let me ask you this. Hell no, nah, my nigga. I'm on the wrong block and everything, nigga. A couple of nights. Couple nights, I'm on the wrong nah, block. Bro, they had to wake me up. Ooh, pray for Jesus. Hey, let me Hell ask you nah. this then. What's the most geek you ever been? Buy your marshmallow. Uh, I don't know. I woke up this morning and uh, <laughs> I couldn't I couldn't believe it. I made it this far in life after all the shit I done did. So I was geeked up. Yeah. That's a, that's the most geek I ever been. This morning. This morning. Just breathing. This right. nigga done seen God and he was still. Pray for Jesus. Oh, not that. Uh-uh, pray for Jesus. Uh-uh, you ain't gonna put that on me. Make people think I'm crazy. I ain't never seen him. Mm-mm. <laughs> you just went, you just went <laughs> looking for him. I went looking for him. I ain't seen him. <laughs> Make people think I'm crazy. Ain't, ain't shot dude. He's he every time all. he open his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> ain't ain't shit he gonna be able to say that's gonna make people think you crazy. Trust me. He can't Stop do that. $2. Stop. Let Stop $2. You don't know why none of my videos. You did. <laughs> but what made you see spaceships on Bank? I did see spaceships. You bullshit. Fact. Fact. Big fact. Well, you, well, you like right, by the chuckle. Look, man, look. I, I didn't even follow me, too. You was by the chuckle. Bro, I had to look. See, you don't think I'm crazy. See, you don't, you finna get me in trouble, No, right? tell me. No, we know what the hit shit. You finna get me This is shit we've been waiting 20 look, years to ask you, Bro, I'm telling you, look. I stay, I stay, I stay, I stay in Douglasville. I bought my first house. I'm like, ooh, this shit fire. You know yeah. what I mean? Pull on. I came from Bankhead for right. what I seen in Bankhead. Same shit. Sit on the ground in, in, in the middle of some dude. Like, oh, oh, what wait, the fuck? Wait. Sit doing on the ground. The UFO is sitting in the middle of some dude. No, no, dude. The dude on the ground. But it's sick. I hit the ground like, pff, pff, how the hell some soot popping up out of the ground and some wet grass? Right. So I'm just in the diagram like this right here. Boom. Right. I got on video, I show my home, but like, boom. <laughs> we get to the other, I keep telling me, I did it. Right. Like, how the hell I do that? I don't even know where to get this soot from. Right. Like, this alien soot, nigga. This, <laughs> this ain't, soot right this here. This ain't no regular soot. The soot. The soot? What the fuck is that? You ain't never burned no chuckles if did your arm. Um, no! What the fuck? I never this burned myself. Amazing! You don't know, you never got no jail hall tattoo when you burn the chuckle. I, I did, I did it like the, the you know, eraser you, and I did You put, you, you say you put the, put the, the, the paper on top of the cup, uh-huh. and then you put the chuckle at the bottom. All the stuff that go to the top that you scrape off, that is it. I was only in jail for 31 days, I had to do all Pray for Jesus, I did mm-hmm. too much time then. Shit! Look, look, look. Okay. Nick did my tattoo on my arm. He got to fight before he finished it. And Edge had Jack on there, my mama named Jackie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Jack. I got the stuff up now. Tomorrow we got to do this shit right here. We got to get the I and the E on it. I got to get this. What the hell? What it look like, bro? What it look? I went around to everybody in the dome like this. What it look like, bro? What it look? Like? Hey, beat that nigga up. That nigga said he don't have the Jack. Hey, Doing the tattoo and the nigga. I'm in four now, four hundred. No. Nigga just swing the door open. <laughs> Boom! I'm like, wait. <laughs> he got to fit it then. I wanted to help the nigga, bro. That's how you fit him a tattoo. Because you got oh, Jack on that. I had Jack on my arm. I could not hang with this nigga all bro. day. Bro. Bro. Jack, my nigga, he oh had to fit it that. God. You bro. in jail and you got look, a nigga named look, Jack. I ran out of eat. I ran out of eat. Uh-huh. So I had to go around. I just got in the door. I don't know nobody. Right. Well, I'm knocking on nigga door. How you burn the eat? How you do the boom? So somebody had to go pop the socket for me. So the nigga had to pop the socket like right. you finna light a cigarette. Uh-huh. And he it. lit some milk and boom. Now I want to burn the chuck piece. I got another chuck piece trying to burn that. But it's my, don't do the chuck piece, do the chuck piece. It's the bad one. I was like, all right. So I did the chuck piece. Uh-huh. 
and burnt that bitch and got some ink. Look good. So you got chappy ink on your skin. Nah, it's up under that. I gotta do it over. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, oh nigga. Oh. This nigga here, man. This nigga is crazy, bro. Oh, my God. Wet sight. But if you would have seen it about 10 years ago before I made Laugh and Taffy, all oh, my tattoos were ugly then. But you know, when you get a little money, you fist. Yeah, because all my shit from the elbow down, boy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, tell us how you got with D4L. Oh, that's easy. I know. It's uh, shot low was the, the, the man. I was going through that. R.I.P. the GOAT. Did see R.I.P. Shawty. I was going to see him do the trout. He had the $600 ounces of gas and the $200 ounces of mid. What? And he was the only lying. nigga with it. God damn. So after I went broke shopping with him, I said, <laughs> <laughs> hey Boy, that shit was not <laughs> cheap back boy. then. Now, that shit was $800 ounces. Nah, 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 man. Uh, I had uh, went to went to a program with his sister. And uh, I seen Moot be at a gas station one day. We're like, man, tell Shiloh to put me on or whatever. You know what I mean? And uh, Moot be like, I'm telling him, I'm telling him. And uh, he went, I guess he told him a couple times. I ran into him. I, I started playing basketball when I did get out. <laughs> okay. <laughs> he had a couple skids come pick me up to play basketball and stuff like that. And uh, he said he was going to build a studio. He did, you know, and all of that. So, you know, it kind of worked out like that. But I walked up in <laughs> looking for him because I knew his sister. Right. And he was like, yeah, you bought some weed. Shot a loaded man, like nah, 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 nah. nah. But I, I, I went to a program. Nah, I went to. <laughs> it was a time like that though, where we were like that on the street. Yes, it was. Nah, man, but uh, nah, niggas be want to hear them type of stories or whatever. But nah, he just, he just got them, took me to play basketball and shit. He used to throw all these programs and stuff like that, and he was genuine. Nigga tell you he was gonna do something, he did it, and I stayed down with him or whatever, you know. So now I walked in that motherfucker. He let me stay in the base, let me stay in Moot B car wash, like you know. Cause I just got out of prison. Like you gotta think, niggas just. <laughs> you you do. Up, I'm out there. Exactly. They don't know the base was a studio. Yeah, I I, I, I I hung out with him for uh, you know for a pretty <laughs> pretty long time before we even became. You know, he was always saying he was gonna build a thing or whatever. But it, everybody was in and out of jail and stuff like that. And then one day he just bought the building. And you know it was serious from that point on or whatever. So yeah. He, Did y'all know that y'all had a hit when y'all made that laughing tap? No, oh, no. <laughs> So nah. we break that down in this industry. Oh no! Laughing tactic. I left the club one night with this girl. Uh, I forgot her name. Had shoes on. I had my shoes on. <laughs> <laughs> I left the club one night with this girl or whatever. Uh, everybody had them left out of the studio. I had the two tracks on the CD that uh, K Rap had did for me probably hey, bro, like three nights shout before. Shout out to K Rap. Yeah, K Rap. He one of the dopest yeah. producers. K Rap actually Atlanta. did K-Rap on the ma- this. I had two. I had two tracks on this CD. Both of these tracks learned style career. That's crazy. I'm the man, and Laffy Taffy track was on the same city. Went crazy. Then the only two beats he did in the studio that day. Damn. And I walked in there and dropped the Laffy Taffy on there. And when they came in, I was like, y'all want to hear that right here? Boom. Everybody didn't want to get on it. Oh, da, 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 da. But, uh, you know, we started performing it, stuff like that. And niggas in the back like, boy, I'm finna, I'm finna put first on that right there. You know what I mean? Boom. So, yeah, it came together. Damn, Everybody crazy. jumped out. When Lo got out of jail, he recorded on the man. And while we was on the road, Lo just came out the road because the song was blowing up. Like, yeah, he can not even do that. Like, the song just already blowing up by itself because we didn't put a CD out. So, people were picking him. Wish I went crazy. Crazy. I know why, but the why, white be my girl. See, everybody God, know God, that God, one, God, but they don't know this one. I'm um, shouty, L-O, got him for the L-O. Yeah. Switch the ice up, rock the blue and the yellow. Yeah. Yeah. Still in the ghetto, yeah. doing my thing. Bang. Got yeah. the blase, whoop the woo, and, and the chicken wings. Yes, sir. <laughs> that was that real West Side. Baby. That nigga used to go. Yeah, yeah, but the first time, the, 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 but the first time I actually met Lo was in high school. I was in the band. Like, I'm going to, uh... What, what instrument you play? Ooh, I, I, I play a few instruments. You bullshit. I was in the band, too. What you I, I ain't play? Ain't you ain't never played the snap. You don't want them niggas. No, I ain't never played the snap. I can play the trombone a little bit, For though. Real? Yeah, but I, I, I ended up making drum major playing cymbal. I, I was about to say, you had to be the drum major. Yeah. You ain't no way Nigga, can you imagine a band come on the field? They all the way in the other locker room. All you hear is, Barbara! Ah! You gotta go crazy. <laughs> Turn it up! <laughs> Did you like going to band rehearsals? <laughs> No, I had two. I had band for my fifth, uh, fourth and fifth period, and uh, so I just leave lunch and just. Well, I hung got an A and B lunch, and then I had band all day. Why high school? Greater high school. Oh, you went to I went to. Well, I got kicked out of Washington, then I got kicked out of Archer, and then I went to Jog Coat down in Brunswick, and then they let me in Greater, and I just prayed to God they just let me in one just more. Please, just just I got to be back in the city. I can't be. But I went over there. But that's the first time I went somewhere where they just had everybody. Like everybody was there. Like right. white people, black people, uh, Chinese people. Great you know, like the greater. But they let you out of school for an hour. I was like, boy, I'm free. 
They let you out of school for an hour. Well, I had never even been over there on well, uh, uh, well, Boulevard, but well, never they were never the same. Goodness what? gracious. Right back to school, they don't even know who doing school. it. It's they don't even like, know who it's doing on, it. It's, on, it's in Boulevard. Well, you know I, boy, I go like, up and down the street, boy, I go back, my book bag be fat. I go sit down right at school, like, boy, that's so gravy. Hey, and I get on the bus, go over there on the bus and to take, I'm on my what you taking a duffel bag for? I was like, I got gym class. I'm just walking down the street that long time, just, ooh, look at that, ooh. And I had an Alpine, you know you had an I Alpine back then. Give me no, that. No, no, you know we didn't do that. Well, you had the, uh, you had the, uh, you had the believe that, but we, we the spark plug era. Yes, sir. Bro, that was the end. I'm, 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 way, I'm legend at that, but y'all yes, owe me, y'all owe me for that I didn't know what that was. Right. I was like, it ain't gonna make nothing. But I used to go down there on peace train battle. Down there, you know the old blockbuster. Yes, sir. Houston, right there, blockbuster. Everybody think you're big Frank Ski, but it was the mix. Mm -hmm. And then blockbuster were right, right behind. Ooh, Jay, I go in that park lot. Like just ooh, look at that. Ooh, what's that? Pray for Jesus. She just <laughs> left that in the car. Is that a chinchilla? Mommy. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Now translate that shit y'all just said for a nigga like me. <laughs> Don't park your car, cause I'm gonna go in and take everything. Okay. That's and it? Chinchilla. Nah. Okay. I got it. You, I, you, I, you, you right. left it, but I got it's it. It's yours now. You're yeah. going around the west side with a chinchilla in the summertime. Don't know what it is. Everybody <laughs> talking about, it's a squirrel. <laughs> you see how every song got a story? <laughs> I fuck with it. You know another one of my favorite songs, yeah. too? Bitch Can't Do It Like Me. Yeah. What? Bitch Can't Do It Like Me shit. No. That was the first song we did. See, if Bitch no. Can't Do It Like Me put us on. See, everybody don't know that. See, I'm, you know, I mean, I'm, and I'm just going to go on and say this, too. You know, niggas like, why you don't do documentary? There ain't no use in doing documentary. We was on the road with Franchise, chopping it up with them. Cool, everybody cool. I knew uh, Pooh from uh, from um, going home. You know what I mean? I had worked with Pimpin' already, so you know we were familiar with them. So I went on. The, I had jumped on the Money Remix, jumped on the road with them. Boom, they get on the road. White teeth start blowing up or whatever. We was out there with them. Then one time, one day they was just by themselves. Boom, boom, boom. Then see them for a while. They was just on the road, seeing them on TV one day. The nigga was like, who did the dance? Who uh, made up the dance? And the nigga, uh, Paulet was like, I did. And we all just looking around each other at the studio like, what the fuck wrong with this shit? You know what I mean? Boom. And uh, I, that nigga Pooh was doing the beat. Pooh was home from college. Uh, with us. And that forget I had just met Pooh. Pooh got them in that bitch. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. He was trying to figure out how to get it. I was like, do that again right there. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. He was like, I just, he said they ain't got it in the computer. Let me put it in the computer. When the computer. And as soon as he put it in the computer, I came in and be fucking thieves. Dun, dun. That's the first thing I said on track, because that's how I felt. Fucking thieves. We D for well. And we back. Yeah. Mm, bitch. <laughs> bitch. And so that, that was the first thing I could think of. And they were like, boom. Yeah, yeah if y'all came up with it, then I bitch can't do it like me. And so, goddamn, uh, we started blowing up on the street with that, but Lowe's in jail. So we couldn't, we couldn't really sign no deal and nothing like that. Cause you know, Lo, Lo just, he, he was just that type of nigga, man. You know, we just wanted to make sure we did the right thing. So a nigga, he had them took care of all of us. So it wasn't no, nobody finna go nowhere. We never had no, no, no think about nothing like that or whatever. So right. when I guess when they came home and they heard that, somehow like, them nigga blowing up. They talking about y'all or whatever, woo, woo, woo. So they go in the studio real quick with a big production and a big, you know, <laughs> campaign and do the lean with it, rock with it. So. Everybody was thinking they came out with it, you know what I mean? But I was song in Atlanta, like the number one song in Atlanta, but we ain't had no, no national, yeah, right, we ain't had right. no major distribution. So goddamn, you know, just fate, what happened? We dropped that Laffy Taffy and then it was just, what? But you and Lay good, y'all good, not Oh man, them, them always been my fault. They still don't stop that they stole our dance. That, I shit, I've shot with Parley all the time. Right, right. <laughs> I, I just got through talking to Parley, wanna see my call out. Right, right. that old yeah, G, I, I was talking about it on, on the line. Ooh, I was just talking to him yesterday. I'm, OG, I'm gonna I see him tomorrow and go say the same thing on camera. I ain't gonna tell no lie, pray for Jesus, who? Yes, sir. <laughs> Who? I've been gone 10 years, what I got out for? That right though. Nah, I just felt like, you know, the powers that be and the handlers at the time just felt like we weren't gonna be nobody. Like, we weren't gonna make it. Like, how often do niggas jump up out the hood? Like, they was the first niggas, but they were one song in front of the wave. So everybody think, oh, this a whole snap movie. Nah, nigga, that bitch can't do it like me came out. They heard it just like everybody else came home and dropped them a snap song. Then Lil John dropped them a snap song. And everybody, yin yang twin, I know that ain't my phone. Pray for Jesus. You caught a fair game. Oh, no, every dime count too. Give me mine. <laughs> got another one right there. Nigga. But you know what? That bankhead era ring crazy. Right you know what I'm saying? I get it before I leave. I pulled up in the AAL. I'm good. Fuck you, talking about? 
Mm -hmm. right, I'm gonna make sure I get it before I leave though. Right, yeah. But you know yeah, you no. make it here went crazy. Yeah, man, I just felt like, yeah, I, you got K Rab, you had D4A, you had Shop, Shop Boy, Boy, you had Baker Roll Click, you had FMG, uh, which Young Money. You had, uh, I mean, you had, you had a lot of them niggas on Highway <laughs> Bars. I, I don't know, I can't name them all, but right. you had a lot of people came through there. And uh, I just remember, I see everybody saying, oh, oh, I created the snap, I did. I've been gone. I'm, I was in Japan. I, was, I said all our documentaries. I yeah, you were doing in Japan. Shit, living. Just over there, just living. Yeah. Screaming out Barb. <laughs> that too. They, <laughs> they like, like that. Like they like that. With my bra. Yeah. They, they like most songs With like in Japan and stuff like that. They like songs like Cupid <laughs> Shuffle. Yeah. Uh, you know, I'm on the Cupid Shuffle too. I know that. Cupid Shuffle, the One Chance song. Uh, they like the One Chance song, Scotty. You know, I mean, but see, the thing is about it when you go overseas, or whatever, the first thing you realize when you go overseas is uh, it ain't no 15 minute show. So you be back there, you be like, hey man, how, many, how long you, you how long like, you okay, want me to go up there or whatever? You be like, you got your thing to put up in the screen? I be like, what screen? Like that big screen out there, you go out there, like big ass screen, got your name going across with your logo. You know, I had never seen that type of stuff before, but uh, yeah, they be like 45 minutes. You know, like, 45 minutes, your show city might be 12 minutes long. Like, so that's why you see a lot of artists be up there. They, oh, good loving, but I got a girl singing. They ain't to kill that time. Right. You got to kill that time by 20 minutes of love song. And then he'll do his song. So that's, that's what you were doing over there in Japan. Mm. Just doing shows and shit. Yeah, I mean, that's where artists invent that type of creativity, at, you know, because over here you get the club, boom, go in the VIP, drink your bottle, pop, pop, pop. You leave out of there or whatever, you know, you can go sit down, you know what I mean? You do two songs. You stand up on the chair, boom, it's over with. 2,500 to 20,000, you know what I'm saying? Every, for every artist over here, but you get in Japan or somewhere, you're Germany, you gotta work for that money, boy. I am. They'll be out there yelling shit you can't understand. The <laughs> toy shit, you back there, but a bitch going, woo, 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 You think the commercial be fake? Okay. Them folks, but they really be rocking them. But them folks be dead serious, but they can't speak a lick of English, boy. But they say, laffy toffy, but they sing the hell out of it. What they say? What they say? Laffy toffy. Every word up. That's hilarious. Man, we got two West Side diggers in. And it being from, that I'm not from Atlanta, what makes the West Side unique? Because Atlanta, you know what I mean? The it city is of Atlanta. Atlanta. <laughs> but the city of Atlanta is small. You don't know that till you get here. A lot of this right. shit is yeah. outskirts. But, you know, from somebody that's not from here, what makes the West Side different from any other place in Atlanta? Fulton County, APS. Mm, no, it's the West Side. <laughs> it's the West, that's Atlanta. I no mean, it's part the West in Atlanta, Side. No part on the West Side is another city. Or any or another zip code. It's just, it's it's just, it ain't, it's zone time. one. It's zone one to the four. That's it. That's the west side. West yeah. all day. All I, day. I don't know. I, I would go zone one. To, I don't know. I don't mm. know. You know, zone six the is four, on the limit. The fourth is its own entity in itself, But depending though. on what happened, well, you know, the four got. But that fourth is just the fourth. Adderville, but that's what I'm saying. It's just, Oakland, now that, I would look at that as the SWAT. So, 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 that's SWAT. That's, that's SWAT. So yeah, I would still. Okay, yeah. Bankhead is zone one. Yeah. From Bankhead all the way to the block. It's still SWAT. Y'all kind of like the SWAT. Y'all niggas already know this way. shit. Help me understand. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. I mean, all right, go ahead. Explain this shit. The west side is the west side. So they on the southwest side. You know what I mean? So if you go over there, you see your little sign in your mirror go southwest. That's that's it. Okay. That's that what they call that the southwest. The SWAT. The SWAT. Southwest. Swat. That's what that means. Southwest. Because Bankhead Northwest. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And we on the northwest side. And the side. zones is yeah. broke down into sections like. Yeah. You just let me know from, where you at. I'm from Perry Home and Bankhead, though. See, my mom, you know, grew up in Bankhead, and then we was over there every day because my mom from over there, but she got her own apartment in Perry Home. So you know what I mean? What I grew up in Perry Home. Perry Home, same side of town or whatever. It's about probably like six, seven miles out though. Oh, okay. That's an that's an OG project. Okay. Yeah. Oh. That was a larger project in Biggest. Atlanta. If, it, if you really from Atlanta, you had somebody to stay in Perry Home. Yeah. <laughs> you literally had somebody my to stay. My mom worked at the store. My daddy, my my daddy, my daddy ran the pool room. He owned the pool room. Well, what about uh, the uh, uh, yeah. tech wood? Ain't that, wasn't that a project too? Yeah, that was yeah. a project too. It was kind of like going to a, like, wasn't it kind of like downtown, going to a downtown? downtown, downtown, downtown Lucky Street. Like going to a downtown. No, you ain't just. He brought that nigga a map. Nigga. Oh, I don't always. To be honest, to be honest, this gonna help me. To be honest, wait. To be honest, this shit is. Wait, what's that? Hey, man. Like zone two, nobody claimed that shit. Bro, you snitching, bro. Huh? You snitching. But he break it down. Don't 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 say nothing. I don't know if he the police. He ain't the police. I don't know what the fuck he is. Come on, fam. That's my nigga. Damn, dog. He ain't the police. He ain't the police. He don't know where the west side is. He don't know. He from D.C. I'm from D.C., nigga. Niggas in Lothonia. That's like a nigga walking in the trap saying, hey, 
you got the herb. <laughs> like, I mean, in Atlanta, I would like two the marijuana. Side that. That's like, please. Now, on, I was trying to find it. On his defense, on his defense, right you now. got niggas in Latonia saying they from Atlanta. Nah. Stone That's Mountain. what I'm saying. When I come down here, nah. I, I, every man. nigga say if they you from Atlanta, from, I know now that it's some parts nah. of Atlanta that ain't Atlanta, nigga. If you ain't, if you ain't, you know, that shit ain't Atlanta. If you ain't, if you ain't, if you ain't, if uh, 30314, oh, 30331. Uh, three, 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 Folks like, nigga, you knew Sam Sam Mo, you stay far here. Okay. Four four, I'm a four four boy. Okay. If everybody part, West Side, I, I remember four four. When four seven seven Mo with, with that, it, you had four four. Was, if your name, you just had four four seven nine one seven nine two. Right, right. It was easy. It was easy. It was like, easy. Your shit and then easy. somebody came out one day with like a seven seven Mo number. Like what that? What that was like? Wow, seven yeah, seven Mo. Like, why? Your number was seven seven Mo. Like you they like, were man. like what? And then they did the six seven eight. It was the same way. Wow. Right. Where they doing it at? You know, it was like that. Like, I mean, Six, seven, I've been eight. around since Star City 9. I, nigga, me too. Nigga, I'm call your ass back. You, remember, you, you take your phone all the way downstairs, your mama pick that motherfucker. Hey, they got nigga going up. Take your ass to Nigga, my mama, yeah. over, she, oh. she was old. She would fall asleep on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> she had a phone in her head. I'm like, I've been off the phone. Hang up the phone. Hang up the phone. Hang up the phone. Hey, yeah. I'm talking about for real. Nah, that shit to be crazy. Then 6, 7, 8, kind of like <laughs> with, with the Knicks Atlanta shit. You feel okay. what I'm saying? Then your mama ain't calling nobody back. Who? Who did he call in my goddamn house? He don't want you anyway, helpful. <laughs> hey, that was the worst shit when you waiting on the call. You just gonna do that to her like that? Hey, DC, you, you come home for a week trying to call. call my number. Uh, that like, girl right. called. Which one? Ah, uh, what you call it? <coughs> call uh, her back. Ah, uh, ah, uh, what? Uh, ah, uh, that one you be uh, you know that girl? <laughs> Who the fuck called me? Now you can't call it back. That's why there's some niggas out here don't know who they soulmate is right now. Man, wait a minute. Man, this man, 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 wait a minute. Research department. Research Research department. The man over here keep picking up his computer. Yeah, that's, that's, that's the, the, that's the that's research department. That's how you get it done. Yeah, yeah. We got to have How much they pay you? A lot, man. Well, that nigga is <laughs> responsible <laughs> for all the information. I can't talk that. When a nigga give you a word, but that like a letter or something, they're like a prison number. They go, All right, but they gave you forty. I got a number, but they gave you me a L. That's how he just said it. How much they pay you? A lot. He got I can't top that. Yeah, he it's straight. a wrap. They already know it too much. He's straight. His I grandson is straight. Favorite weed. <laughs> no, they're two dollars. I got some more. I, got I ain't gonna call you Favorite no more. I feel too. like I know you. Two dollars. The two trap still a blank check. Nigga, pull that out of the money. I ain't seen a bitch fake yet. What? What? What's that name? So when you Steve, pull your money out, look at the glasses. We gotta talk about the glasses. When you pull your money out, a bitch post the face. <laughs> no, I'm just saying, you know, niggas be flexing with their money all kind of ways or whatever. Sometimes I just walk up, I ain't got a dime, and you know they faint. That's just how I felt at the time. But I'm saying I'm old now, man. I don't know if nobody gonna faint no more. Right. It's one crazy. or two. Don't be shy. No, I'm just they go crazy. <laughs> Why you bullshit? No, I done been in several situations where it was, it was, it was uncomfortable. No. But ah! it was, bro, I, I don't know what to do. That song was that big. You got to think, we stayed up there more than five weeks, more than six. This song big. Right. But it get to the store, but I come out there with they got them dickens on with about 30 colors and get to the front of the stage. But, ah! but who? Oh, it over with. <laughs> but who? No, no, no. How you wake him up with two nah, hours? No, no, no. I was watching the Michael Jackson tape. I was watching the Michael Jackson tape. <laughs> hey. Don't wake them bitches up with singles. Uh, she ain't gonna uh, wake up on no dub. Uh, you need $2. Uh-uh. It's $2. Uh, I ain't throwing them a penny. We pitch a penny to the wall. Why you faint like pitch, that, we pitch, a, <laughs> we pitch a penny to the wall. He did it two times, too, with his hands out like this. Ah! Damn. <laughs> that nigga said, don't be shy. I know that oh. voice. Nah, nah, nah. It went me. It went me though. It went me. It went me. It went me. No, man. I mean, oh, you know. Shit, sometimes I mean, you know, when you different though. When you different. Low turn around. When you different. Low, look, 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 look. look, 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 look. It's two dollars. But you all more head butting me like a mother. Oh, but I felt that. But I felt that shit go. Oh, 
Hey. Oh my God. Bro, that is a legend story. Bro, you know I'm going to say that shit every time I see you. It's two dollars. It's two dollars. Stop, two dollars. Hey, man. I got some people that be walking by me and just go, Fabo! It's just like a natural thing for me to go, oh! <laughs> no, <laughs> that's just that way to see that shit. I die laughing. Oh, he talking about oh. oh you not gonna walk with me anywhere. Going crazy. That's all man, day, you a day. fucking legend. Oh, I don't give a fuck. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. You a legend. I, I just think my name come as in all capitals or something. Hell yeah, dude. You did that. <laughs> You did that when we first when you came to did Wild and Out, niggas was like, "Hey, boy, oh, that's like, it." Yeah, I like, told him I had to be on that. Yeah, oh, superhero. Man. That's what you want to be. That's real <laughs> dumb, dumb, man. Say what's up to the devil, Susan? Still having fun, man. I stay smoking. I stay high. I get geek, geek, geek until the day that I die. See, I'm starting to see spaceships. So can I ask you a serious question? I know this shit here get get real. Blue this episode is sponsored by Blue Chew. My name is Carlos Miller. Bluechew.com. Trust me. At this point, you already know. It's people asking me, man, what that Blue Chew do? Blue Chew brings you the first chewable with the same FDA approved active ingredients as Viagra and Cialis. And it's a sexual stimulant. Now it's not it's not gonna cure any ailments or anything like that. But it will have you making sweet, sweet love <laughs> to your lady. Blue if you can benefit. For more confidence where it counts, Blue Chew is the fastest and easiest way to enhance your performance. These pills are amazing. Go check them out at BlueChew.com. If you could use a confidence boost or you just want to feel like your old self again, trust your mans. Use the promo code. It's only $5, man. You can try it for $5. Go online. BlueChew.com. You can go right on your phone. That's Blue. B L. U E Chew C H E W dot com. Hey man, make sure you hit that website and use their promo code. I just want you to see what all the hype is about. You get what I'm saying? Trust me on this. Use the promo code, get your first shipment for free. 85 South. I put that on everything. Times is hard out here. You feel me? <laughs> yeah. The shit get hecky sometimes. Yeah. The music shit gets crusty. Yeah. Well, there are times. Or a moment where you were just like, you know what? Fuck this shit. I retire. Now nah, I realized the money ran out quick. <laughs> Pray for Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> it's two dollars. Uh, now, man, uh, I, I I feel like you know sometimes when you're on the street all your life or whatever, you know, you, you get that bag, you definitely start thinking about, damn, I ain't got to do that no more, I ain't got to do that no more. And, one day the phone rang, you might not want to answer it. Like, man, fuck that shit. I ain't doing shit today. So, you know, that can turn into two weeks or two years. You feel me? Shit. If you, if you got it. I, I, I made Laugh and Taffy. I own all my rights. Oh, well, bullshit. that's a blessing. So, he ain't bullshit. But the money, 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 money do run out. Yeah. But, but that's the thing, though. Unless they see you, and then the money go right back up. Right. But that's the thing with us. Like, we got to start, like, like how you said, we from the hood, bro. Like, yeah. We done had plenty of niggas to catch they spark, catch they fire. When yeah. I was young, we saw y'all, we was like, my nigga, these niggas from down the street. <laughs> Literally. Two, three minutes away. Yeah. So if they can do it, and if, nigga, and I can't wait right until it's our time. You see studio what I'm saying? Studio right on Street. And not playing. Right there across the yeah. street from the motherfucking pawn shop. Right on Street. You dig what I'm saying? Them niggas will be out there. Yeah. Real talk. And, you dig and, what I'm saying? And, and it's a deep First nigga you see in the morning, the last nigga you see when you go to sleep. Man, standing right crazy. in front of the door. That had to do, what that do for you, though, fly, <clears throat> being a nigga from the west side and really still being in the hood and seeing them niggas still there after all the success, the type of motivation that gave you? It gave me to be like the same reason how I be like, like hope. You know what I'm saying? Like, my nigga, like I said, we from that side. They, the west side, they yeah, is. Yeah, ain't from that Niggas man. don't, niggas don't understand, like, you, you, it's a, it's a, it's a small chance mm -hmm. that motherfuckers really not gonna make it. You know what I'm saying? Ain't like no every every day. Huh? You feel what I'm saying? I got to out. So man. when a motherfucker, so when a motherfucker see yeah, the west side quicker. and see this shit <laughs> and see what's going on, no, he really from here. In DC, I know shit get. I, I do the go go. Really? I got some. Ooh. Oh, you do? Yeah. See that? I can talk to you about that. Style. nigga. I know about all that. You got some go go music? Go 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 wild. Yeah, I got some good go-go. Nigga, music. you have been a legend in the go-go. Nigga, nigga, go love great. you, nigga. You show up in the go-go. I got that a homeboy named Super G. He, he making a push up there right now. You know, he got a uh, cannabis line and all of that or whatever. Right. Oh, I really? also, you know, you get dibbing, dabbing. I got a couple of, you know, situations going on with the cannabis too, pre-rolls and 
you know, edible nigga. line and all of that. <laughs> nigga, you gonna, so, yeah. nigga, you gonna win with that, because your energy, nigga, we nigga just wanna win. get on we, the level you We got you two on. locations in, in Chattanooga, and we're working on a couple more, so they're going down. That's what's up. But just to pick back up off that shit, though, just, it being for the west side, just said, nigga like him, Charlotte, we talking about street niggas. Yeah. Not nobody who would raise in the house. We talking about niggas that was outside at a right. time where <laughs> it, you had to really be gangster to be outside. Right. In the 90s, early 2000s. Right. Not everybody outside. Right. No, 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 no. Nigga, you staying in the house if you not really about that shit to come outside. I wish I could get you my see what I'm saying? Kid to come outside. So it was like, man, that shit just, shit just beautiful. Kids don't go outside. Kids don't go outside no more. I ain't never had they nobody. They scared to get musty. I can't even get my kid to go out the door, man. I don't want to stay. Man, I literally got to go to the door and hold something on the other side for them to come out. Like, bro, they ain't coming. You got to trick them to come out. Skateboards, they got too much inside. bicycles, yeah, bikes, scooters. Fuck all that, nigga. I'm on this internet. I don't TikTok. even want to go buy no, no, Minecraft and Roblox. Oh, yeah, all and that shit. Fortnite. Going crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, Wait, they buying shit that don't even got no no special abilities go with it or nothing just because it look good. Right. Special no. abilities. Yeah, on Fortnite, you need that extra shit. Niggas Call it skins. But see, that's the beautiful thing. Like, I never had, growing up in my city, we ain't never had nobody that came from the hood that made it big. You, We looked up to all the go-go singers. Like, I wanted to be in a go-go band growing up. I ain't never yeah. want to rap or no I shit like that. I figured that shit. Hell yeah. Nigga, what you want to play? I wanted to be in a go-go band. Nigga, I wanted to be the lead singer of a go-go <clears throat> band. My cousin, Big G, one of the most legendary Niggas to ever Let's come start, out to go go. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Gangers, you know what I'm I saying? like the go go music, man. Yeah, so I mean, to be able to see y'all, two West Side niggas, to be able to have that connection, you walk outside and see a nigga that's really from your side of town, and he they made it, and they still there to give you that motivation. That's beautiful. We need more of that, my nigga. Because them niggas was really still in the hood. Like, yo, niggas bought, I met Charlotte in the street. Yeah. Like, it wasn't no, and I no concert, no nothing. You feel me? Like, I was 17 years old. And first time I met him, we shooting dice. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like in my mind, Did I'm you like, win? yes, nigga was betting. <laughs> nigga was betting nigga bet forty to my twenty. He was like, nigga pull out the biggest. He you gotta be able to get ready no to gamble. He was like, you know what, shout I bet you forty to your twenty. You ain't gonna hit that ten. I said, shout it. I'm like, I ain't never seen a nigga double the money that I'm betting. I'm used to shooting dollars and shit. First of all, I'm not supposed to be betting twenty dollars. I ain't got them, but like $40 in my pocket. <laughs> <laughs> you dig know what I'm saying? I'm over here talking big much shit, I but I got two right dubs. If I lose it, I got one right more now. dub. I can you feel right me? Now. I can hear them right now. You can't break Boom. no bank. Can't break no bank up. Boom. I'm talking about the guy. Whatever you got, what you got in your hand? How much? How much you got in your hand? <laughs> that's when I knew, but that's that's when I knew he kept his niggas with him. Like I knew niggas who was around him then. Like they was young niggas. I'm in the house, and I'm just like, boy, 15, 20 niggas in here. You feel me? And he really got his squad with him. Fast. And and not on no, not on no. Where you from? Woo woo woo. He was like, where you from? West side. Okay, cool. You family. Straight like that. I put a little something on. Oh, no, do me like. But. Ah, damn, bro. Damn, bro. Two dollars. <laughs> I just had looked up. I looked up. That shit just looked too good. That shit looked too good. Hey, the crazy part about it, I did it myself, gang. No, no, no. I swore on everything. Cut mine. I did it. I did it. Cut mine. Your shit going back. I can't do that. Nah, my shit been like this. Why I got my baby picture, but my shit been like this. Your shit look like a W. Well, you got me fucked up, but I watched that. Boy, fuck out of here, boy. I got you know my baby shit. picture, boy. My baby picture. I been had a big old forehead. No, I did this shit myself. I ain't even finna show you, bro. I did this shit myself. Trust me. Trust me. I did this myself. That's why I got to go on. I don't do mine. That's why I'm never done. You gonna do mine? I had to let this. I'm getting old, gang. I ain't even put on one of Beijing. I just need to. Nah, it ain't no Beijing. It's just little spots that need a little touch up. I am. Uh uh. Man, I'm sitting here writing a movie with you two niggas. It just need a little touch up. You know what I'm saying? Look, let's bring it on this side. I see the movie, nigga. We going. Bring it on this side. look like he half cleaner and half predator. I don't know which one. Me? Yeah, but I take the head off again. Oh, yeah, no problem. Going crazy. Oh. See, I can't do either. That would be a lot of stuff. Hey, nah, nah, I can't. That's why I won't get Bruh, it to be too I much black. I thought you used to have a ball here. I, ain't never I had, did, I nigga, but 2020 came. Brain. And I was that nigga. I didn't never have braids in my oh, life. This I'm shit new. I was like, I just shot me. Nigga, I was bald in March, nigga. Now yeah. I got this shit. You, so I, even having hell, you, how did she feel? You don't like that so from March? Yeah, from March to now, dog. Hey. How did she feel? Nigga, amazing. Nigga, I grew up my whole life never having braids or none of that shit. Nigga, I'm getting all this shit this year. Fuck it. 
What you gonna do next? Nigga, I'm, I, bro, I, I don't think I ever heard a nigga, nigga say amazing like that, but bro. Nigga, nigga, it's amazing, faithful. I'm, I'm geeked up, nigga. nigga if you come out, about. if you come out with a finger roll, about, nigga, I'm geeked up, nigga. That's my what bro, I feel like when I put bro, this shit bro, in, nigga. Man. I ain't never had bro, no bro, shit bro, like hey, this. Man, you know what though? I ain't lying you though. Know? I, I oh, thought yeah. I was bald and wore a bald head just because I thought I was bald. What made you think you was bald head? I just felt like it was. When I used to get it cut, it was always been thin up here at the top, and then my granddaddy had one of them noggin, but you know he ain't never go bald like that. That, but I just felt like that, and I ain't never really wear. Well, what made you grow your shit back? Cause the uh, pandemic bitch told made me, me one day back. I was bald, <laughs> <laughs> and I wanted to prove to her that I went bald. <laughs> and you went crazy. But yeah. you was bald. See, I, I got spots. No, missing. I found out I went bald. So you bro. I mean, you making it look great. I made it look great, but I got hey, but hey. I know I love. I roasted a lot of people, but I didn't know sometimes you you start missing hair. Yeah. Not just at the edge. Yeah. Nigga, it might be behind your ear, nigga. Yeah, but Big I ass pat. You like, hold I up. I ain't missing none, though. All what? behind here. I got to keep some hair right here, just behind my ear. Listen. When you got this much hair, when you got this much hair, you cut a piece off and you, you patch it in. Yeah, your shit ain't gonna never Hell fall Hell no, out. that nigga. shit gonna come straight out. What I don't have to do that, out? but I'm hey, just saying. What if you yeah, go swim? I can look, your shit ain't gonna never, your shit My is shit like is dry and limp, nigga. Your shit ain't gonna never fall out, nigga. You know that shit you scoop out the dryer, nigga? You try to make sure the dryer. That nigga shit look bro. like a dryer lip. Oh, nigga. shit. Never, it's oh, hell no. Nah. Hey, shit that's in the back. Hey. Hey. No, nah, that's the, you nah. know, you got to put the filter. The filter. Look, I, I, I scoop that shit up. Man, hold on. I ain't got no engine in my blood, boy. My stuff, but I can't even put a comb through it, bro. I, that's what I'm saying. Real nigga. I'm one of them little kids, but I can't even put a comb through my hair, bro. Like yours. Like yours. I just need a little moisture. See, one thing about it, we need to put moisture I don't got no hair. I ain't got shit to offer. Listen, black people, if your shit get too rough, moisture. We see your hair nappy as a motherfucker. He don't act like that shit look good. Tell him, That shit look good because it nappy season, but <laughs> there been a time when he had to shape it up and cut the little fro thing before you went to work Ooh. and go, you? Oh, no, see, well, I had a fro. Well. When I was young? No, nah, I'm talking about when you go get your jaw interview or something. Like, you ain't go like that. You had to cut it all no, pretty I, and stuff I, I, like that. Job interview wasn't really too good for me. For real? No, nah, because they felt like I was overqualified. Oh. Mm-hmm. They say, oh, this nigga really want to work. I call you I uh, back. I ain't you can get the fuck out of here. I had a job one time. <laughs> you, you trying to take over some shit. I had, uh, <laughs> I went down to the, uh, and this is just how fucked up it be, man, for us. Uh, I went down to the stadium, I was working down there. I was uh, riding the little golf carts and stuff, taking all the ice and stuff to the suites and everything, you know. So they asked what they want to work for the Olympics. I think they were right 95, something like that. That's the last time I had a job. 95. So 95, I think 95. Damn. Man. So, yeah, they asked that, that we want to go to work for the Olympics. So we took off from the state and walk all the way down there to sign the papers and stuff somewhere on Peach Street. Like, that's a long walk. Like, if you know that walk, we by Peach Street train station. So we're going there. Some girl was like, oh, y'all fellas? Or whatever. I'm like, no. Nah. I went up going there. Boom, boom, boom. They ran your name and everything. Get back to the stadium. They ain't let by six up back in. And we lost our job right there that day, too. No. Damn, for what? I was just like, I don't know. You were overqualified, my I was boy. Overqualified. You did. So I figured, you know, every other job I went and applied for, they were gonna do that. So you know, I just they by the grace regular. of God, I ended up here. <laughs> so I, I did a good <laughs> job. I, 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 I worked it out. Said, yeah. He said they need had direct deposit then. <laughs> no, nah, hell no, nah, bro. Look, bro. They didn't want to give me my check when we went back up there. Boy, I had to work three days, but I didn't give. We went out there and stood out there, boy. Like, no, nah, we worked for the uh, Aramark. Ooh, I know that. Aramark you know. is him. But everybody works for Aramark, boy. Aramark tips are everything? Mm. No. no that's the know. food service place. I ain't care who it was. They gave my money. It was $106. Pray Wait, for Jesus. Crazy. You acting fool about that 106, didn't you? Nah, I had another job while I was there. They had robbed me. Uh, see, it was a Braves stadium. So I go down there and just get a ball. And I look up there and see who hit a home run. And I catch everybody in the hallway. They did a home run ball every game. I was good. <laughs> <laughs> That's legendary right there, dude. <laughs> you know, hey, get what? That was you that called it? I saw you. <laughs> I used to work at the Braid, too. Paul and Paul? Yeah. I was up there selling weed and shit. <laughs> yeah. I said, but he ain't geeked up. I ain't, up ain't, I ain't selling no weed in there like that back then. I was a church boy. Me, too. Yeah, I, I grew up in the church. I, I, I didn't do that. I, was, I hung out at the preacher. You said, I do that lead thing. I used to uh, preach a son to karate. I couldn't afford it, though. So he just come home and kick my ass all the time. I learned all the moves. <laughs> you know, every time I try to use it in a fight, it didn't work. Right, it right. Because you don't know the shit. <laughs> <laughs> Why they move up in the goddamn car? 
<laughs> my name two dollars. You don't know me? <laughs> two dollars, nigga. Need for you to come the fuck out. <laughs> nigga, crazy. But look, right? I got the last line though. <laughs> That's how I did that lead thing. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> ah! So basically, it was the same way when you went into the alley and almost headbutted me. You should have warned me. You ain't warned me when you almost headbutted me. Nigga, I ain't know your head was on my side. I, ain't my know, mother. I moved out of the way before I did. You got up, nigga, and that shit's it. But see, I've been doing it so long oh. while I'm about to take pictures with people. I knew you were right now. Hey, I'm that you see man, that? Nigga, foot was in his pocket. He's saying that that move came from some karate he did never learn. Nope. And they ain't never used in a fight, Kyle. So you gonna try to kick. use the moves he used No, to I tried ass. to kick it, nigga, one time. He grabbed my leg and scooped me. I ain't never used it again. I went in the right way the next time. I went in the right way. Them feet, them feet dangerous, but if you don't know how to use them, but you gonna be like, ah, oh, my bad. It's over with. I ain't mean oh, to do that. Like, Bro, it was just like that too, bro. He caught my shit in there and then fuck. I told you and start running around with me. I'm like, bro, that nigga was swinging your ass. Bro, no, I was trying to scoop back, like scoop my leg away. Then my shoe came out. It was on there. <laughs> you fell. You fell trying to get out. He scooped me. Oh, nope. okay, okay, okay. Yeah, if your I, fucking if shoe came book. off, you did not win. It was, I ain't win. I, I ain't never did. say I won. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no. Ain't gonna get me telling no lie. And I, and I yeah, that go to police. Everybody talking about. What you talking about, nigga? Get this nigga up on me. Come on. He got a good move, bro. He's gonna beat me up in front of everybody. Oh my god, dog. He got them niggas out of UFC your ass yet. That nigga say I ain't never say I won, nigga. He ain't win either though. They gonna police, nigga. Bro, I got knocked out one time though. Stop playing. But the nigga ain't know he knocked me out, so it don't count. Bro, how the fuck did the nigga not know he knocked me out? Nigga sell candy and shit. Right. Nigga tried to get the donation from you, put a dollar on your nigga check right, right, for your right, donation. Right. Like, okay, you gonna keep on trying me like that, boom. So he doing it every night by three, we get in the parking lot. We up at Union City in the parking lot with the cars and uh -huh. shit at. Walking between the car, I'm like, I'm arguing with the, the other nigga. They like, this y'all come across there. Eat my cousin along, boom. I'm on the car. He take our running though, he don't see it. Right. He take our running, I'm leaning up against the car, tell him, I said, don't fall. <laughs> Boom, when I come to I'm like, I'm gonna kick your ass, but I try to take that first step and realize though, you know how nigga follow me. I lean back up and get in the car and start arguing with the nigga in the front. You let that nigga hit me too. You just let him so I came all the way back, but I knew. Right, you knew. They was already scared of me though, but Oh I was, no, he ain't knocked you out, he just he he knocked you right. Me, I, I was out. You were out. If you ain't hit that ground, blue yeah. country, yeah. you were out. You were almost. Bye -bye. The car just woke you back up. You like, hey, boy, bro, I am back. Bro, look, bro. The fuck out, was bro. that? I knew I couldn't catch it. Bro. Hey, it wasn't even the fact talk. that he, I was out. It was the fact that he snuck me. Right. And he was a little short nigga. He jumped and hit me, bro. Was like, yeah. The nigga jumped and hit me, bro. So you were out. That was like, that made an extra. So when you got hit, you were out. I was out. But when you hit the car, bro, it woke you back up. Get what kind of car it was. What? I was on them Corolla truck like oh the bitch. I'm like, God, I can't pass no, out on this. I can't pass out on this. I can't pass out on this. That be a high. I'm leaning up again that much, so you know they sell all kind of cars. Oh. By the end of it, oh. I kind of walked on over to a little Benz and leaned up against that and went up. I said, if I pass out, I'm pass out right here. Like, pass out this time. You know hey, this nigga said, this nigga hit him so hard he got mad at the old boy. Hey, man, you let that nigga hit me, bro. <laughs> Bro, I had to do something because I was in the fire. You know, I try to keep myself occupied. Right. Whatever I could do, but right. I was out on my feet. Hey, man, you say you took that first step? Bro, when I caught that little nigga, boy. It was a rap. Nah, they jumped on me. <laughs> <laughs> I wish the story could end good for me, but it didn't. Hey, man. Beat the shit out of him. I ain't no jumping on the <laughs> I ain't no jumping on the motor, but my shirt was all torn and shit. <laughs> so, I was mad at him. I cut the nigga ass out all the way home. Say I can't keep my head on me, you know, fuck nigga. It's still a fuck nigga. It's just a fuck nigga who can fight. Oh, he tell me you just a fuck nigga that can fight. Oh, oh shit. Hey, welcome to the oh. motherfucking wayside, oh, man. Oh. You did. Oh my god, dog. Hey, hey. And y'all see this shit? Man, man. Oh. It's the habitat. Oh, oh man. man. I'm out of here. Hey, man. It's the habitat, bro. Hey, man, that nigga said I had to get on the bus with my shirt ripped. He talking about, nah, they jumped me. I still was covered in that. Oh. Nigga, oh, stop $2. Listen. Uh, stop $2. <laughs> he talking about $2. <laughs> ah, it's $2. Man, man, you, you let me know you finna do it then. 
I was already down there that time. You gonna hit what? Hell, man. <coughs> you ain't stupid. Uh huh. Perfect. Jesus. Real West Side story, bro. Shit. You dig what I'm saying? Stop, man. I can't breathe. I can't what? breathe, man. Man, this ain't regular life, bro. I feel like I was ah, there. This ain't regular life. I feel like I've seen that. Bruh. I think I rolled past that fight. I was like, hey, oh, nigga. Oh, God, man. <laughs> He, he said, said get the fight. That dick came up through that nigga, hit me. But well, you should have seen me chasing him around the car. Nah. Get on my fucking clothes. Get on my fucking clothes. Little black ass nigga. You was chasing shit. them days. Get on my motherfucking clothes. No, I came all the way back while I chased him again. He walked all the way back down. You know how the Waffle yeah. House at on Union City? Yeah, ran all the way to the Waffle House. <laughs> You ran out into the Waffle House. Mexicans will hit your ass hard. Oh, oh my shit. God, man. <laughs> Chico, you a terrible <laughs> man. Get on my Hey, man, what? Man, that shit there was fucking dog. I'm that mad. nigga said, um, man, I you just... let that nigga hit me? <laughs> man, I'm telling you, bro. <laughs> I couldn't fall on the ground. <laughs> yeah, my whole thing is I couldn't fall. Right. Like, and let them know he was going to stump me out. You oh, see what I'm saying? Man. Oh, he definitely was going to do that. But right. see, that's the thing on the west side. Yeah. Niggas say that it's it going to be a one, bro. And literally, and then a nigga really jumping in. He just bullshit. Hey, no, no, ain't no jumping. Why stop? Soon this shit pop off. That's why they jumped on me, because they knew it was going to go down, bro. (laughs) Dude, right? I don't know what it would have happened, though. The way he hit me, I probably didn't need to fight now one on one on one. I'm just saying. He said, I'm probably gonna fuck one on one. This nigga crazy as fuck, man. I'll tell you one thing, though. He tried to get in one of my shows free one time. I walked right by his ass. No. Well, I pray for Jesus. You did. I walked right by him. Boy, you a, boy, you a neck, boy. Oh, this nigga man. crazy, man. You don't want to smoke with that nigga. Like, but get what I heard, though. What? I heard the nigga do be squabbing on, so you know what I'm saying? That's just the upbringing. Oh. Man, you win, you win something, you lose something. That's why this shit's so funny, because all these yeah. niggas out here that act like they undefeated. You must have been in one fight, nigga. Oh, no, I, I tell a nigga I, quick, I, I'm I, not undefeated, I ain't nigga. I done lost ain't undefeated. I ain't undefeated, I ain't undefeated I but my last fight I won. Nigga, I'm telling you, I done lost, took some L's, but that's the thing. When we lost, nigga, the only motherfucker saw you on lose the nah, was the niggas who was you fighting and who was there. Now you can't take no, these young niggas now can't take no L's. I mean, it ain't wrong with fighting, but now I still can't. Now that you can't on take the, no on the air, like I can't the retire. Same scenario, Losing. nigga, that'd have been on camera, and Fabo would have had to kill a nigga. The nigga, the day you come crazy, he would have got, got that nigga right. Listen here. Uh-huh. <laughs> Fable ain't gonna kill nobody. Nobody. Well, not the Fable time. now, but I'm talking about Fable $2. Fable then ain't gonna kill nobody. <laughs> two dollars was, two dollars, nigga. <laughs> Told no. you to check the damn couch. <laughs> <laughs> you said a little shit. This nigga is retarded. Two dollars was what you said. Right. I ain't gonna lie, I never knew when I got my ass beat. And that's when I realized when I told myself, you need to know how to fight. Yeah. Not real drop. That was what you were doing. Yeah. That wasn't it. Uh, but, but see, wasn't that the time? Wasn't that the time when punches oh, started hurting? Oh, no. Punches were hurting. Like he grade, was rocking my ass. My shit was like, you. Seventh grade, nigga. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I was like, somebody don't talk yeah. this nigga. Uh, <laughs> God, what kind of glass did he take? Because I need that one. For the one I got, mm-mm. This ain't it. Boy. That went what you want, bro. Good. That went what you want. accurate. Want. I'm like, that nigga, nigga everywhere I go, your fist is there. <laughs> <laughs> That nigga I'm like, got oh, that nigga oh, I'm like, God damn. <laughs> <laughs> God damn. I tried to sweet that nigga was like, God, I'm like, nigga. <laughs> that nigga said, who's that? accurate? God, you are great. I'm done. Hey, man. I call it quick. That nigga Bruh. telegrammed the punches, nigga. Man, that, that man that, was great. That, that went the only fight I lost, though, in my life. Yeah. Of course. I mean, if you'd have been, you been in enough, you ain't yeah. gonna let you, I don't know who. I got to fight with some finger wave one time. No. Nigga, yeah. what the fuck? What? Some you finger, wave, finger wave, bro. Yeah. What happened? They were doing finger wave back then. Oh, so you got to fight with the nigga? Man, I had the whole top laid. I walked out the door and got the fight. I ain't never do no hairstyle no Your shit look like Big wow. Red when he was hanging that nigga out the window. <laughs> Say it again. Say it again, bro. That shit look like Big Red. Ah, Get what ah, I did. Man. Get what I did. Ah, Get what I did. Was, when I, I seen was I was losing that fight. What? Don't go to police. Oh. <laughs> Same thing. Same thing. Oh, oh, man. Out of there. Everybody took off faster than oh, they did the last shit. time. shit. My nigga. I should have said that because they were watching. It worked. It worked. It worked. That shit worked. They go to police. They go to police. I should have thought of that. Funny thing about it, y'all think I'm playing. No, I no, don't. Fuck I don't. don't. Fuck we don't, nigga. Nope. I know for a fact. Oh, right. bro, that nah. time the nigga threw me on the sidewalk and hit my shoulder. So I knew my get up. Yeah, like literally. 
the scoop, the boom. And when I showed it, hit the ground, that bitch went the wrong way. And I knew my get up game wasn't going to be where it was supposed to be. So right. I didn't try to get up. You just stayed there. That go to police? <laughs> <laughs> hey, bro, I had no. gel all in my eyes and shit. I, it was like brown gel, too. <laughs> somebody to my, you bleed. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> that nigga done whooped the finger waves off your ass, man. <laughs> hey, like I said, when that nigga big red hey, bull comes back in the bro, world. Bro, bro, get what, bro? Get what? Little bitty nigga, too, bro. Uh, not a little bitty nigga. <laughs> hey, you don't need to fight short nigga. Bro, hey. Hey. Bro, 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 hey. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. Look, it worked out for me, bro. I'm just, <laughs> I, I, I want to tell you a good one, though, but, I, you know. Man, please hey, man, tell me what. We got to go on I had to put the blunt down. I done choked about four times, man. Man, low. Man. They say, bro, get what I said. <laughs> They go to Berlin! <laughs> I'm telling you, them fight then. I, I won a couple of those, you know, but hey, I ain't gonna man. tell you about those. I live nah, nigga, that was this. But the ones I lost, though, whatever. That's the real nigga. That's the one that's the one that he lost. I ain't never won finger ways again. He taught me a lesson. Why? Did the nigga fight you because of the finger ways? No, nigga, you get your ass with the hell dude, don't never put that hell dude back in. Right. And they went for me. Right. Evidently. Shit. What made the hell dude put that hell dude back in? Trying to impress the girl. Everything I do is trying to impress a girl. God so, damn. So how, so when you walked out with the finger waves, did the nigga hate on your finger no, waves? No, see, like, fuck your finger y'all, waves. I think the y'all, nigga wanted to fight no, you before. No, see, that. you looking at the pictures thinking, oh, them nigga with them finger waves. They, no, nigga back then. No, man, I, I, I know that. that. I know that. I know that. I know that. That's what I'm trying to tell you. No, I don't know about that. Nigga, his uncle do finger waves. Right, exactly. Talking? You was getting on me about that, nigga. You got <laughs> Now you mad. Yeah, that's why. Ain't no that's why. my hair, though. That's why, because he got his ass on. No, no. I didn't do my hair. I didn't do my hair. I would think it more like Eddie from Five Heartbeats. Uh, Eddie had finger waves. What about Eddie? What they about whooped J- his ass too. J- what about JT? <laughs> that, but I, I named the right nigga though there. <laughs> but JT had finger waves. Everybody in the movie had finger waves. That big nigga whooped JT Ooh. ass too. For fucking his wife. Yeah. I should have left that shit in the movie. You should have. I'm trying to tell you, boy. I was playing the wrong character that night. I should have been rocking that boy out there. He, he got on the floor. Yeah, he knew yeah. he couldn't get up. Oh. That nigga said, man, that'd be the worst. I knew my get up game went gonna be with us. I don't ever see when the nigga get knocked out. He run forward it. Boom! No, I ain't wanna be that nigga. Nah, you that get all this skipped up too. <laughs> right, you know, you gotta take what you gonna got already. <laughs> you get your ass whooped with some finger waves in, yeah. and then they come undone, but the back part still be yeah. crispy. Yeah. Still, what? still hey. crispy around the middle. Y'all had looking like a little Bro, you seen the dinner. Oh my God, man. Then you gotta go home and watch that shit out yourself. Mm-mm. <laughs> I went right back over there to the mother who did it and had them watch it out. And I cursed them out. Oh, you put these damn things in my goddamn head. I couldn't even fight back. Like, <laughs> like, 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 like she had something. Oh, that was good. That was good. Once you got Once up. you got back. Yeah, I just, when the police came. <laughs> hey man, what song? What was you singing in jail though? Because the police you think didn't never come. about that shit. Oh yeah. What I was mean, you singing in jail? But when you got to think about it, when you're in a hole in jail, like you know, what I mean, you in the cell, you ain't no TV, ain't no nothing radio, ain't nothing. So you know, you sitting in there, you can lose track of time or whatever. And so you know that you, you got nigga doing poems. You got somebody who got one book he done read it 13 times in two weeks. You know to everybody because ain't nobody else got no books. And so you know. You got niggas that sing. Niggas in that bitch singing every song in the book. But I ain't going to tell you sing the songs that I was singing back then because it wouldn't be appropriate for this moment because the artist, you know, who was popular at the okay. time. I get what you okay. Had all of the hot songs. Yeah. 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 Come on, Kilo. Nah. 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 The other dude. The, with the one who will remain nameless. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> 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 You ain't warm and you finna do it again. You almost headbutted me again, see? Cause you ain't know what I was gonna do then. Hey man, he ain't gonna headbutt you too, though. This has been one of the funniest experiences I've ever had in my life, my nigga. Straight up, bro. Hey man. Two dollars, this is the trap, man. Legend, man. You can come to the trap now. I definitely appreciate y'all, boy, for having me through. You know, hey, R.I.P. Shout out. I wouldn't be shit without shout it. Hey man, give us a shout out of story before we get out of here. Oh, I gave you the bad one. You did. Yeah, it forgot. wouldn't be shit without him. You right. Everything, you know what I mean? I, that's what I would say, you know? I mean, uh, I seen him do the community thing before that. I, 
you know, I seen him do a lot of stuff or whatever, but when he said he was gonna do it, he got them, you know, put the equipment in there, built the booth, the see through the little thing, you know, I ain't never been a part of nothing like that. I ain't even ever really been. I've been in the studio a couple of times, but I mean, this being built for us. So, you know, I mean, shit, that's the best story I could tell, you know. He said he was gonna do it, and we came through for him. Oh, y'all, boy. Man. Thank y'all, man. man. Shout out that boy. Mook B, stunt, man. What's happening, man? Don't leave him hanging, Fabo. Fabo. They got a cold oh, bill. Ow! Uh, $2. You tell them they got to come to the trap. Oh, yeah, man. You know them boys got down. You, you got to holler at them and reach out to them, man. You know Mook B was like viral the other day, day for cussing the nigga at the gas station. Yeah, nigga on Camelton Road. He cussed the nigga out at the gas station. Oh, Mook B. Boy, Mook B don't play. But yeah, Mook, but you gonna pay your dude, boy. Mook, he got them. He went in Burger King, boy. Just, he just, he just asking for basic stuff or whatever. You, if, if you in the neighborhood, you know what I mean. Shit, pay your dude. Me don't take much. Give a nigga a cup of water if he ask for a cup of water. Don't put everybody out the store. You feel what I'm saying? Right, right. Cause you got some people who, who who come by there 30 times a day, but then you know somebody walking the door is clear. And you ain't never seen them before, and then you might be thirsty. Give him a cup of water or whatever. You know, I think that's what he was trying to say. Yeah, right. you take from the community, you need to get something back. Yeah. Fuck you mean? Motherfuckers running up in here buying shit all day and you act like you can't Big let fat. a nigga put a post in the window. Fuck out of here, nigga. We come here <laughs> every day. Fat. Big fat. Every day. If I didn't want to come in here and just get some food, <laughs> see, I pay, I pay rent and this Oh, we ain't never had no too. problem. I ain't never had no problem at the store. Right. Boy, who? Boy, 50 cent worth of cash, boy, you won't be here no more. Say what? Pray for Jesus. Mm. That's it. <laughs> Leave it at that, man. You dig what I'm saying? The stove with a stove, man. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah, Your own gas, too, if you're a gas station. Yes, sir, ski. <laughs> <laughs> that boy, Ryan, eh? Yeah, I like some. Yeah, what you got? I don't know. Man, I like a hit me. Nah. A hole in the muscle. No, that's, that's, a, a, <laughs> that's a That's a 325, 350. Right now? Yes, yeah, so I'm not. Ooh, it's wait, time wait, see my, wait, you see my new toy I just got? It's a 400, but you do need to have a dime to put something on that muscle. Tipped around. You hear me? You know what you got to put on the back of that motherfucker? What? Ow! Ow! <laughs> Two dollars. <laughs> Two dollars. <laughs> Bitch, I my Wait, new you again. Huh? I was doing no. one of my You, you just want to do it again? Come on. All right, all right, let's do it again, motherfucker. Let's do it again. Here we go. Two dollars. Hold up, nigga. I got to be the fan. Ow! <laughs> oh. Ow! Two I was gonna make you do it by yourself. You got to be <laughs> nah. You stop me, now we gotta go together. Play we gotta go together, come on. We gotta go together this time. Uh, I, I ain't know if you're gonna get me this yeah, time. Yeah, nigga. We gonna go <laughs> <laughs> How about we wait this time? We both like, time. nigga, now, nigga. Nah, all right, I all right, nigga. Wait. I gotta wait. All right, then. Hey man, I definitely appreciate y'all boy for having me on though. Come on man, you're a legend, uh, man. Legend, baby. Motherfucker, legend, game, Bobby. Yeah. Anytime, man. Anytime. Yeah. We fuck with you over here at the 85 South Show, man. We give motherfuckers that fly over by the hill, you dig? Yeah. Hell yeah, yeah, man. Keep doing what you're doing, keep pushing. Yeah, man. Bring me that big wheel my daddy didn't give me either. Got now y'all just giving away flowers to everybody. I want something different. You want, yeah, man, you want a big wheel, my buddy? <laughs> yeah, I don't even I, make them no more. Yeah, they do. They got three in one. That bitch will be a scooter now. See, you ain't even seen all so that. So you just want to raise the scooter? Nah, I you just, just want to do the other I just want to put it in the closet be, and say I got something different. It ain't going to fit in the closet. You better be careful what you say, man. It's a lot of people watch this show. Somebody going to fuck around and build you a goddamn scooter. A big ass scooter. And then they going to, hey, dude, see if y'all can get this scooter. Favor with me. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I definitely the shit out of me about it. Yeah, and then yeah. you had to find you got all you. my information. This is the same information that Wild and Not got, and I'm trying to find out what they're gonna do about I that hate, shit. I hate to tell you this, Fabo. Yeah, yeah. Look, wait, yeah. wait. Yeah. I, won't nobody else say it? You didn't ask. But about we it. already know. No, but that would let, me, let, me let you know. Say what we already know. Right. They let us go. They let you go too. Man, oh. let me stop, man. Boy, you looking for some, boy, you looking for some bread? You ain't gonna man, get it. You ain't gonna get it. Yep. You ain't gonna get that and one. Man, if you ain't get your money by now, please. Hey, boy. Two dollars. Oh. You better I read the contract. I told you you gonna get that quarter there, nigga. That's all that. they got for you. Two dollars. Hey, so I get my hey. change off the floor. And let them know how it go. Let you don't get paid till the shit come out. Yep. Yeah. 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 We yeah. already know that. You better watch. And it ain't coming man, out. You, you know better what? reread your contract. I need to contract. let y'all know who Dolomite hit up. Craig Rock. We need to call Craig Rock. Because when Dolomite got in this same situation, Eddie Murphy. Mm. You ain't seen the movie. What? Chris Rock told him to hit his cousin. He went to the theater himself with it. You see what I'm saying? So maybe we need to. But that ain't our shit to go yes. get. That ain't That's what you're not understanding. Well, we, well, we, we got understand. five years of life. We definitely understand. Long. But we had to make every effort, you know, for that Almost bread. That. He said we had to make, make every, every effort. effort for that bread. Yeah, you <laughs> know, we really had to make every effort for it. Yeah. Woo. You don't know what I've been through, man. Man, I get you what? don't know what I've I can't seen. Even imagine. 
I've been there, man. <laughs> I, 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 I was in the fucking trenches of the money. The soot. He's talking about the trenches of the money. In the soot. <laughs> in the soot. Oh, my God, man. You OG, man. Forever, man. You dig what I'm saying? The That's the side craziest part about it, going in there trying to negotiate for your goddamn money. For real? Oh, my God. That's the worst shit in the world, man. Some man. shit that's old to you. Man! I like to negotiate for my money in the beginning. That's where it yeah, all but it up. wasn't shit to negotiate because it wasn't shit. They they played it so well. Uh, look, wait, they played wait, it so wait. well. They I'm, made I'm us think. I'm gonna let y'all have that conversation. They made it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm not talking about that. I'm just saying in general. They, oh, like yeah, in the beginning, yeah, yeah. when my man. I don't want to be in the middle of that conversation. Oh, you, you're great. <laughs> Why not turn us up? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know nobody who. You know, they were like, man, Fabo was up there too, that <laughs> But he know I wasn't thinking about that. that. No, 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 he wasn't no, no. thinking about that. We were talking the whole yeah. overall game in well, the, in the, the game. game. I, I yeah. got you yeah. again. That's what I was getting at. Again. It wasn't. It ain't that. He said, "I got you again." Got you again. Yeah. Oh, man. See, now you gonna make him think that I was telling like, man, he was about to say it. Nah, it wasn't. I wasn't no. Just speaking in general, man. Yeah. You know what I'm Facts. Sometimes when you out here negotiating these contracts, mm, mm, you got to negotiate mm, mm, the money. Ain't had no more of that blood over there. We won't roll in there. Pray for Jesus. You did. And then he gonna be like. You asking me? Keep, keep on going. We'll go to time. <laughs> He's still there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. We locked and loaded, man. We appreciate you coming. Yeah, man, I definitely got a couple of surprises coming real soon, man. You know, uh, I think we did the finesse movie, and uh, we got a Crystals commercial maybe coming. You just did really? K yeah. yeah, yeah, the, the K Camp song, too. Oh, okay. The Tatted Up remix. That song right there be banging. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. I'll go check that out. I just seen oh, it, too. Yeah. Yeah, that video crazy. Yeah. Yeah, y'all were just shooting that. Yeah, skeeting everywhere. I mean, oh, 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 wait, wait a minute. Nah, 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 that I dare you. All in no. I was skeeting the water. No, no, no. Skeeting the water. Me. No, it's what crazy. They caught you. No, no. I was skeeting the water. Hey, no. That shit can't cross no. my head. I can't do that. You gotta wrap it up. No, that nigga said skeet. I said wrap it up. Wait till you see the video, though. You're gonna see what I was talking about. Fabo. It's two dollars. Two dollars. You gonna see the video? You are gonna be like, oh, okay, I, I get it, I get it. Hey, I know one thing. The name of this motherfucking video, the title of this video when it come out gonna be two 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 dollars. Oh, I have to try it one more time. One more time. You ready? Two two pop. I yeah. think I do it this time. I might get. Oh paid. yeah, but now nah, they might sue us, <laughs> nigga. Don't do it. No. <laughs> they get crazy. Don't do that. Then you say be quiet, motherfucker. Pray for Jesus. Hey man, this has been another rendition of the 85 South Show. Here we out, DB. Oh, Make sure you tune in this week to catch me on 85. Hey, hey! He's working, yeah. Phone twerking, yeah. Bitches fucking, yeah. In traffic, fucking, yeah. We came from nothing, yeah. Yeah, nigga, yeah. Yeah, I raw. Yeah, I kill. Yeah, I get them deals at them California hills. Just because I fell back, that don't mean I fell off. I got big dog status, hitters knock your head off. Smoking weed at the school, getting in trouble with the law. Hard headed ass nigga, mama said your ass off. Hard hit a ass nigga, then they knocking heads off. Daddy found that I was GD, then they knocked my chest off. Never been a scared nigga, never been no dumb nigga. I wait back that bread nigga, yeah nigga, yeah nigga. 15 poppin' mess, nigga, could've been a dead nigga. You heard what I said, nigga, yeah, nigga, yeah. Duke Deuce, and you know I'm rockin' with 85. What the fuck?